Hey chat, welcome. It's Rosewood time. Joth <laughs> time. Hello everyone. Hello Kuma, hello Ray. Hello Seas. Ravy Ocean. Hello Kuma. Peanut. Chromion. Layla. Ringo. Good to see you guys. It's the Bringus. The Bringus. Yes, it's me. Bringus the Bingus. <laughs> yeah. Hello. Hello, Starbucks and Xander. I hope you guys are ready. It's going to be very interesting. I'm still setting up, so if you will excuse me, I'll be back in just a bit. Purple Poly, thanks for the five months, man. Appreciate you. Yeah, my man. It's been a while. I'm glad to see you. Ready for new lore? Yeah, you should be. We'll have it at the beginning of the episode. You will see the delicious lore. For now, I'm going to see if I can get into the map. No one's online yet, it seems. We'll see if cookies online. Seven hours of bringers. It's not heaven, it's hell. Welcome. Yes, lore. Juicy lore. Did I say your name wrong? Robopoly? Robopoly. Hello, Kendrick. I see you lurking over there. Welcome, welcome. Let's see, how do I get rid of this window? There we go. 
know. Perfect. It's time for the Umbro Lion to take his place. <laughs> Wait, is it really Robopoly? <laughs> I'm gonna be honest with you. I don't think I knew that. I really don't. I'm sorry. I thought I was Robopoly this entire time. Yeah, I thought it was like Polly, like Polygon. Hello, Viking Oswolf. Welcome. I know I'm doing well. I hope you are too, chat. See if I can find this darn overhead thing. There we go. Okay, we're loading into the map, boys. Here we go. <laughs> Hopefully your bad luck's recharged because you're ready to roll. Hell yeah. Let's get those nat ones. <laughs> yeah, fish boy, drab boy. Let's go. We're gonna whip them up into shape, into mean green fighting machines. Hmm. Yes, we have to save the low rolls for Necromancer Mirren. Oh shoot! I need to turn the camera on. I caught myself, don't worry chat. No more awkward setups, we're a professional streamer now. That's right. No longer will you have to suffer. The setup. Things work out well this time. Yeah, I should just put it right in my tits. You know? Making my way downtown, <laughs> walking fast. Hey, Luca. Okay. Hello. I'm not sure. I get as good. As a bring It's your boy. <laughs> Hello. Hello. I'm still waiting for um, homeboy Leo for the new model. Can we can we just put it back at the spawn? <sighs> so much easier. <laughs> Walking sideways is so much faster. There we go. I know, but can we just put it back? Though? Full body dance dreams. <laughs> the intro is very nice, isn't it? I love it. Fire Emblem music is the best. Also, look, see what I was telling you guys about my VR captures? Look at this. Why is it like this? I haven't moved it. Oh, oh! It's just ridiculous. Oh, now I've made it really big. Just don't, don't mind. No scuff here, chat. No scuff to be seen. We are professional streamer boy. Bring us. Nothing weird. Hair in my face. Smile. There we go. Play some music. Different song. This one. Yeah. Muscle mouse, muscle mouse. Oh yeah, boys. <laughs> oh, 
Uh, we know the the purple boy on our team is Drow. The really short purple and blue people in, in Bombadil who isn't blue are Viki. <laughs> Only professional content for a classy professional audience. That's you, Chad. You're classy. Don't forget it. Yeah, backlashing lion boy saves world. <laughs> Headline of the century. Dude, Muscle Mouse is peak character design. I don't care what you have to say about her. Peak character design. Muscle Mouse. Look at that Umbra Man. It's me, Umbra Man himself. That's me. Let me get let me get a good look at you, Muscle Mouse. What are we doing? Puffing our chest out. Oh yeah, that's character design right there. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Do 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 do. One second. What up, Bringus? Where's my phone? It's in my pocket. Hold on! I forgot to put my phone on mute. Guys, I'm telling you, this is a scuff-free stream. We have never had scuff on this stream. We have never accidentally had our phone go in the middle of a very serious scene. That's not happened several times. Wait, my mouth not moving? Wait. Test one, two, three. Test one, two, two, three, 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 four, four. Oh, I'll tell you why it's not moving. Oh, I haven't been talking this whole time because they can't. <laughs> I have it on the wrong output. Guys, this stream is scuffless. We've never scuffed. We have. <laughs> I've been running around with my microphone off. I'm sorry. Uh, what I <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I was. <laughs> I was like, man, they're not saying anything. Oh, tough crowd today. <laughs> man, no, what's up with that? What did they do? Right? Blueberries, they're having a fight. Typical blueberries. I'll see you next Tuesday. No chill. Where's the third blueberry? Then, then we'll have, then we'll have a real bra. Hell yeah. Hell yeah. <laughs> Put them on each other's shoulders and maybe you can finally reach. <laughs> oh, you forgot your step stool, madam. There you go. <laughs> what are you doing? Go take your fucking kneecaps. No! I need those to be tall. Oh my God. Please. Oh my God. Uh, what are you doing to be quiet? Uh, Fuck you, I gotta get out of here. I'm so fast. I'm fast as fuck. I'm so fucking fast, dude. Good morning. Oh, hey, oh. Go to the mess. Hey. <laughs> I don't. <sighs> Tell me about your people, little one. Oh my god. They're not my people. I'm racist against my own people. <laughs> that was a very short, it's a very it's tiny scary. whip for you. I was never here. <laughs> god damn it. God damn it. <laughs> I gotta untwist my cord. <laughs> you, you don't wanna whip. Whip Don't want to fall Nene over. With me? <laughs> I'm sorry, but <laughs> I'm on, whipping whip and nay naying for whip someone else watch these me. days. Whip, whip. Watch me nay -nay. whip for me, bro. Come on. <laughs> There's someone else I want to whip Come with. On, I'm man. sorry. He's not here today. Oh! <laughs> oh, you fucking traitor. You fucking traitor. Stop, it's kind of uncomfortable <laughs> when you hit me. <laughs> You. Your tiny little bony fists. They, oh they punch through the it's armor. Who's that? I've no. <laughs> it's me. It's, it's, it's me, Stella Luminette. <laughs> God damn it. Somebody, somebody get the fucking bobby pins. <laughs> bobby pins. It's not my fault. I, 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 I like. Here, I look. <laughs> look what I crafted for oh, you no. in, in, in oh, Crafting damn. Club. I made a fucking deadbolt. <laughs> 
There you go. <laughs> so it is about like a lot. <laughs> Thank God. <laughs> Don't look at her chat. Look at me. Booba is temporary. <laughs> I mean, a bro made of metal, this should never yeah, happen temporary, again. temporary, but the bros are forever. <laughs> bros are forever. Internalized racism. <laughs> oh no. Uh, <laughs> it's Mommy Bellicosa. I don't know German. Shut the fuck up. She didn't. No. Sh <laughs> She didn't I say she wasn't. I was gonna say, are you ready for discipline? And I stopped myself. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> you need to give in to your gremlin brain. I don't. <laughs> no. I don't. There's no cheese here. Get out of here. There's no cheese. <laughs> Uh, Give me cheese screams. Uh, uh, <laughs> uh, I don't have any cheese. I don't have any. Oh. You tried to be one one episode. Do you mean? Uh. What? It's called the cultural exchange oh, program. Okay, I gotta back. Oh shit. Okay. How's the cord? The cord's good. Hello, Josh. Are you leaving? Leaving the stream, removing myself, deleting myself from the Discord with all the professional scuff I've seen today. No. No. Three scuffinings, baby. The Vizings, no, the model, yeah, so we were disputed. <laughs> Del, dis, pick up the disenfranchised youth is what I say. Pick them up and say, oh, look how little. <laughs> yeah, Rosewood time, baby. <laughs> oh, no. I'm going to say that. <laughs> no, I'm not going to say that. I can't. I can't. <laughs> No matter what RP it is, the beginning's always wild. <laughs> oh, lower accurate bring us into choking. No, what? No! Oh, no! I have, I have some characters I haven't seen before here. This is exciting. It doesn't matter. I paid her a lot of money. Alright, get out of here, rat. Get out of here. This is ours. We bought her. She lives in our house. I will eat your hair. I'll hold on to her while you guys argue. That's a good idea. Here, I'll hold on to her while you argue. I already have her. No. I'm leaving. I'll pull her outside. You pull her outside. You pull her outside. Help. Good. I, I think. Are you guys committing hate crimes against the slaves again? Definitely not. No, I'm the one that named the slave. What's your name? It's a Madari. We're gonna eat it after. Amethyst. That's a stripper name. Thank you. <laughs> I gotta turn into a cat. No! Oh no! I hate that! Why did I say anything? I wish I had a filter. God, I wish I had a filter. Oh, it's an extra? Oh, cool. Stripper cat? I'm suddenly interested in the lore? Frio! You can't say that! <laughs> Holy shit. Alright, we good? Uh, <sighs> gotta push that out. Uh, if it only it would grab. You know what, whatever, it's fine. Frankie! Hello, Frankie! Guys, for those of you that haven't seen it, look at this fucking art that Frankie made. Hold on, let me see if I can pull it up, actually. Okay, look at this fucking- look at this amazing... Beautiful- look at this sassy Luca! Already sporting his number of colors and everything. Isn't that sick? It's so good! Very talented. 
Frankie has blessed us indeed. Much talents. Very good. Sassy lion boy. Luke is trying to take over as head of his clan of stripper cats. Damn it, you spoiled the lore reveal. Damn. Damn. Speaking of the lore, though. Um, so... In the beginning, pay attention to audio cues. They will be very important for his lore. That's all I will say before the start. If you watched episode two, you will be familiar with what I am talking about. <laughs> tragic backstory? Who would ever have a tragic backstory? Don't you know that that's cringe? Nothing bad's ever happened to Luca. Smile. Right? Well, let me make this smaller real quick. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> so I saw a lot of uh, comments on the last video that Luca was purring, but it's not a purr. It's a um, collider, as you can hear it in the head, that makes your controller vibrate to let you know that it's active. Uh, and what it does is when you put one hand up, it's a whisper. When you put two hands up, it becomes a shout. It's an amazing piece of technology they crafted for this RP. Head cannon, you can head cannon it being purring, why not? Go for it. Okay, that's good. Tragedy on a bring a stream? Yeah, that would never happen. <laughs> Isn't it amazing? Leo made that. Apparently Gambit had had the idea and then Leo was like, he would be like, man, it'd be so cool if we could do something like this. And Leo was like, I'm gonna do it. <laughs> Why can't there be someone that didn't have a terrible childhood? I will say that of all the backstories of my characters, Lucas is probably the least tragic. But it's it's still good. It's still pretty tragic. Waiting for someone to ps ps Luca. Oh no! If they do that, I'm totally I'm totally leaning into it. Her <laughs> deeply for us. Okay, you know what? Yeah, on second thought, I don't I don't need to use the 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 voice modulating toggle. So let's just we'll just always speak at normal volume. <laughs> Hello, Groxix. Welcome. Again. There we go. Umbra Lion. <laughs> Imagine having talent to just do something that's omnipotence right there. Well, you know, you, Leo's been doing this for a while, so he's 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 uh, earned the the skill. First the pss pss pss, then comes the red dot that cannot be captured. Oh, that'd be amazing. <laughs> Someone needs to have a light spell or it's just a red dot. Hey, you guys see that? Oh, we're having a meeting, I think. <laughs> no, we're not. <laughs> Never mind. <laughs> Lucas' tragic backstory is a vegetable kill. <laughs> Kill his entire family. That's why he doesn't eat vegetables. It's the deep lore. Yeah, laser pointer light mage boy. That would be hilarious. His ultimate weakness. Am I ready for ND? I am. Fortunately for me, Bertram didn't need a lot of changes. Um, he does kind of need a shadow running outfit, but that's not super imperative. Probably won't need that for the first month. Dude, ah, uh, man, FT is gonna be nuts. Woo, we got a lot going on. <laughs> so, the way I'm playing with that aloe detriment I got is, um, essentially, he treats her as a actual person with emotions and feelings now, right? She's a synthetic, but she's now essentially like family or a cherished friend, right? New systems? Uh, ooh, other new systems? I, I thought I skimmed through the, uh, 
um, you know, updates, but I don't remember seeing any. He's not a robo simp. No. No. There's a shit ton more. Oh god. I think I saw a couple of them. I don't remember. <laughs> you have a theory about something that happened in FT? Is it something in the past or something that's going to happen? Because if it's if you think it's something that's going to happen, that could be a spoiler. In which case, I don't want to accidentally metagame. But if it's like a okay, if it's the past, then go ahead. <laughs> a guide in video for a season three. Well, <laughs> thanks for telling me because I, I did not know that. I'll go check it out. Um, Bruns is currently deciding. I think debating we'll see i hope that he does i really do because then you know we'd get rp together again it'd be fun in world website editions in-game health crafting system ability points oh shit okay That's fair. good to know <laughs> a cherished friend that we lobotomized yep that's aloe remember kids you weren't best friends until you lobotomize your best friend. That's true. <laughs> Arcane Wing, thanks for the follow. Welcome. Remember the drowner situation? Where do you think all the bodies came from? I think it came from uh, the war, you know? The war or, you know, just like in general. I say that. Hmm? Hmm? What do you mean? What do you mean? You think they came from the cults? Well... Could be. But I think there's just like enough dead bodies in Ari Land that they just generally are around. And the people that have been going missing, I don't think that's enough to be drowners for the whole... ...thing. Because we didn't see any uh, cult members in the swamp. There was no really... I don't know. It's a theory, but I don't... I just don't know. Because then there's like the Draugr in the north, right? Which are just frozen drowners. So I don't know. People have... You know what? That's true. People have been going missing. I know! We didn't even get to dissect one of those people to research them. So sad. <laughs> Mirren does not have the facilities, unfortunately. He would have loved to just like pull them open and be like, "Okay, let me, let me, let me look at, oh, let me look at these innards and see what's going on." I like the theory. It's an interesting theory. Never got to. Oh yeah, I already read that. Yeah. Yeah. Maybe the cult. Hmm. I'm trying to piece together the timeline because the drowner started showing up after Bedaria, right? After we activated the gate, or were they already showing up before then? <laughs> this week things are indeed happening. I'll tell you. You think that Gavis is an illusion? <laughs> That's kind of cool. I like that. He has just kind of been like not present now that I'm thinking about it. The last couple meetings. Could just be in the back, you know, dealing with other stuff. Boring King stuff. Yeah. We'll have faith in the bill hook that'll pull us through. Mirren is a gruesome character. Um, he started out as just a nerdy scribe. He was just an elven scribe who came to Ari Land to document its history. And now he has become like a battle mage um, that has lost like... I mean, okay. I'm going to backtrack a little bit here. In season one, I made a joke after like things started going wrong. I was like, man, I just want to be... All my friends are dead, Mirandal. That's the route I want. And then Bruns was like, say no more. And I was like, haha, just kidding. Like, haha, that's funny. And now all my <laughs> all my friends are dead. <laughs> Except like a handful. I jinxed it, dude. I jinxed the RP. Mmm. Can't 
can't blame the royals now. That's true. It's always been Mirren's fault. But yeah, in season one, he got a, a detriment, like a psychological detriment where uh, he has to know how things work. So like he needs to know things weaknesses, which means dissecting them, taking things apart, understanding their biology and anatomy so that I can best uh, defeat them in the future. Right. So that leads to like this grisly fascination, which is paired with his thirst for knowledge and magic. It makes him uh, the perfect candidate for a necromancer. <laughs> Which is not how I envisioned his story going at all. Mirren did- Hashtag Mirren did nothing wrong. Exactly. Hmm. We will just... Change history. We are going to pretend... Aha! This is the updated model. Cool. Uh... Let's go test this. Oh yeah, Leo's not gonna be here today. That's so sad. That's right, the mirror's inside. Toggles galore, baby. Oh uh, yeah. Let's make sure it works. <laughs> it works. This doesn't work. Uh, well, that doesn't work. That's fine. We don't need those right now. <coughs> I don't understand why my hips do this weird thing. Skirt. There we go. Oi! Hard flashback to my childhood. Thank you, dude. Yeah, man. Is that what the the fire emblem music? Con Mastiff, thanks for the follow. Welcome. Dude, Ren and Mirren have become like a oddball investigating, like team of detectives. I've loved it so far. Man, uh, I'll tell you, it's it's easy to find on YouTube. Just search Fire Emblem Awakening OST. <laughs> Favorite Fire Emblem? Uh, so I haven't played many Fire Emblems. I played Fire Emblem on the Game Boy Advance, and then Fire Emblem Sacred Stones. And then I played, uh, uh, brr, Awakening. And Three Houses. And I think Sacred Stones was my favorite, uh, just for the nostalgia factor. <laughs> just jiggling from minor- chronic minor backlash is all. Dude, yeah, it's great. Constant sex jokes, Mirren being the grizzled veteran while Rin's the hot-headed rookie. It's exactly- <laughs> It's exactly like that! And Mirren's, you know, old partner- it, Awen is dead, right? So it's like he was awake from a time and Calm down rookie Buddy cop show, but it's Mirren and Ren. Fuck yeah, dude. We 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 got to get some art going above uh, Detectives Mirren and Ren Buddy cops Small novella desserts. It's just Fire Emblem Awakening. Hello, Neil. Welcome. Dude, I'm telling you, Necromancer Mirror would be such a sick arc. <clears throat> like, think about that. It's the perfect justification. Like... These dead soldiers are already gone. Their suffering is over. Let's bring their bodies back and have them fight for Auriland. Because then they can't suffer anymore, and then that protects the living. Right? Necromancy to protect the living is totally something he would do. Me? That was weird. That sounded really close. 
Our land is already fucked. Perfect start of a true BBEG arc, dude. Yeah. Necromancer Mirren is a go. Let's make it happen, chat. The suffering is over. It's gonna be a miracle to win the war? Yeah. Well, thankfully, we have a miracle. Magic. Is Mirren evil? No. He's not evil. But, he is easily misguided. Um, he doesn't believe in good and evil. Which, essentially makes him very morally gray. Mirren is complicated, that's a great way to put it. He will do anything to protect his friends. Uh, including sacrificing some of his friends. <laughs> which happened in season one. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Um, God, uh, trying to encapsulate Mirren in a single sentence is very hard. He is an elf. And... He... <laughs> has a bad time. <laughs> He's punished. Yeah. Yeah, his gambles have not worked out. He gets, um... A lot of shit for his actions. Yeah, he's, um, this is the way I've always put it, right? Norman in, Norman, who was my Neon Divide character in season one, in the first half of season two, was a bad guy who did good things, and Mirandal is a good guy who does bad things, right? So, ultimately, his goals are good, but his, he believes that the ends justify the means, right? And, um, Norman, his goals were bad, <laughs> but he painted them, or he used good intentions and did good things in order to cement himself further towards this goal of essentially becoming a magical despot. <laughs> Rip Norman, dude. <laughs> By the way, that's the toad scream of summoning, just so you guys don't think you're getting spammed right now. We can get into that in a bit, uh, why Norman did that. Uh, it boils down to he was kind of going getting unraveled and cared too much about friend and he kind of made a really bad misstep It was all calculated out of character, but um I, I kind of wish it was portrayed a little more clearly why he did what he did <laughs> Why don't we raise bodies? Yeah, why don't we raise bodies? It's just economical A lot of shit to deal with today uh, we didn't make- we didn't make Letharia a whole-ass library. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Cornelius. I love Cornelius. That scene was great. I'm glad. <laughs> I- I still- I'm sometimes shocked when people come in like, Oh, I love Norma's death scene. Like, people saw that? That's awesome. Why am I fucky? Quit being fucky. As you all are aware, there is sorting. So you have that to look forward to. Um, we paint that, that ceremony today and just the only enough that if you can to um, disable full body during it, if if you can. If it's a pain in the ass, don't don't worry about it. But we're we're hoping that maybe that might help with some some lag and some frames and stuff. Well if you shucks. don't know how to do that, you can just open your VR chat menu and click the cogwheel at the very end, and there is a button to click that says disable full body. And it just, it just took it off. And oh, it fucking just, awesome. I don't even gotta recalibrate. So it's just two, two quick buttons. If, if you can, that would be awesome of you. If you can't, that is okay. Hello, can't wait till Neon Divine. I can't wait for more reunion. Hell yeah, anime boy! You can, you can head into that. Welcome, welcome. I'm, I'm, I'm very excited. I can't wait for Bertram to come back. Apparently, guys, Allo got a, a model update. And now she's hot. So I don't know how to feel about that. But yeah. <laughs> we'll see. <laughs> you know, she was like a cute little synth. <laughs> God damn it, Ayumi. I know, right? <laughs> I, I love the old Alo model, but, you know, apparently she got like a surprise update from her uh, model maker. Rest in peace, Team Ignis, for the day. 
<laughs> so people are gonna be like, Bertram, why does Aloe look like this? Oh, oh nothing. Happy time. No this horny. No Look at me, chat. Oh yeah, I need to turn all my settings down. Robot temporary. Luca is forever. Bertram showing his true colors. Oh no. Terrorist shenanigans with my hot synth. <laughs> Clickbait YouTube title. <laughs> Bertram's taking heartbreak very poorly. No! People are gonna all laugh at him. So funny. Dude, <laughs> unironically though, Booza, who plays coach, was like, dude, I don't know why you're going after Vesa. You got this whole Chobits arc, like, raring to go, dude. Why don't you just do that? <laughs> he fucking cracks me up. I come back to the chat just for you to talk of the talk sin of holy anime women. Well, you know, sometimes it just happens. I know, <laughs> I know, right? <laughs> Fucking Chobits. When's the last time you thought about Chobits? Yeah, yeah. Bertram was very quick to daughter, daughter zone, uh, Alo. Dude, Coach is great. I wish we had more RP moments in Season 2. Hopefully we can RP more in Season two, 3. <laughs> is there a YouTube? I only watch Twitch streams of Bringus. There's no such thing as YouTube. I'm actually thinking about making a VOD channel on YouTube. Just to get them out there. People also heard Aloe call you like Master and stuff. Yeah, she'd be like, uh, should I call you like Master? And I'm like, no, just call me Bertram. She's like, what about like such and such Sama? And I'm just like, N no, please, please. Again. I heard the opening the other day in a craft store. It's like this, isn't this Chobit? Fuck, Did they played that in a craft store? Man, I guess we know who was in charge of uh, the store playlists. Yeah, I'm going to be putting uh, all the RP stuff on a VOD uh, YouTube playlist. Yes. Alright, have fun in Blender Scout. Thanks for stopping by. Luca does not have e uh, human ears. He just has these. Oh my god, she did work at the brothel. Oh my god! <laughs> I swear, I don't want to bang my robot. God. Yeah, I might upload clips too. That'd be nice. Almost room with human ears? Ah. Well, there you go. You made the right call. Well done. Okay, here we go. We're starting. <laughs> Good morning. Good morning. Uh, morning. Sorry, I was having a dream. Do you like Hmm? Mm. Uh, sure. Uh. 
Why am I on the floor? Oh. Uh, no uh, reason. Get the drag door. What team you getting yeah, on? Oh, uh. Nah, sad, I, mean, I wouldn't do that. I'm gonna join um Umbra. Oh boy, the purple one. Mm -hmm. oh, purple. Yeah. <gasps> oh, let me uh tidy up here. What team you joined? There we go. Um, I I don't know. I didn't get invited to any. You didn't get invited, it's not good, we you? What the we hell? Get... I didn't get invited to any. You were on the same team. Get on the team. Honestly, I wouldn't mind staying unsorted. You know. It's been kind of nice, but I'm tired of sleeping in a warehouse. I... I don't know. Just... You got to strive to... That's a lot. To... Strive more. Strive for things more. <sighs> you know, there's a whole. I, I don't want to like brute force just get my way in. You know, I, I, I just play it how it goes. Just, let's see how it goes. Then. Do it anyway, brute force. Focus, Luca. Today's the big day. <laughs> Time to make your family proud. Okay. <laughs> Who wants to go grab yeah. some food? Yes. All right, yeah. God. I do. Awesome. Remember not having breakfast? That was right crazy. On. Oh, God. Yeah. I remember. Did we ever figure out if we we're allowed yeah. to cut through these? Um, I mean, uh, I've done three no, times I... while the Chancellor saw, and I uh, haven't been yelled at. Yeah, uh, so. I guess if the Chancellor's okay with oh. it. What this Chancellor okay with? Well, I walked, I walked through there to get over here fast, and uh, he didn't, he didn't yell at mm. me. So. Mm. Understandable. Morning. You just did, Caleb. You just did. I'm so hungry. Oh, I haven't eaten since yesterday. Or since the day before? Two days. <sighs> Where's my sausage? Hello? Someone took my sausage. You guys have been eating? No. Do you have cheese? Corn. Hey, Oriana. <laughs> <laughs> you want my corn and broccoli? You want me to? You fucking eat your vegetables. I don't want today, to. Bitch. I don't want to. I don't care. You eat them. Why? They don't taste good. You eat them, or I sh or I shove the white stuff down your throat. They smell weird. Wait, white stuff? <laughs> what the what? <laughs> what does that mean? Is that like magic? Milk. Oh, milk. Wait, I like milk. Then take milk. I'll trade you. Okay. Perfect. <laughs> muscle mouse, muscle mouse. <laughs> Don't do it. Don't do it. <laughs> Cats are lactose intolerant. No. Oh, well. 
You know how much cats love milk. <laughs> hey, if I get a plate of pork chops, will you eat the vegetables from that too? No. Please? No. Please, come on. Fine. Yes. Fine. Here you go. Wow. Two potatoes in one bite. That's incredible. Do you want to play before you meet? Yeah, sure. Okay. Good morning, Good morning, uh, wait. Don't I? You look really uh, familiar. Do you think that you could make a chocolate cake? <laughs> hey, you're the captain of Lumen, right? Uh, Stella Luminant. Yes. Wait, Stella? I thought your name was Cecilia. No. I don't believe Cecilia has ever attended this academy. Really? Uh, but I met her yesterday, and she said she was the captain of Lumen. Ah, uh, well, that's very strange. I'm sure you weren't seeing things. Pretty sure. She offered me an invitation mm. to, to join, and you look a lot like her. Mm. I see. No. Things are uh, a bit uh, strange around here sometimes. <laughs> Okay. Well, Stella. I also be very careful about moving around during the night time. What? Moving around? What do you mean? The staff can't protect you from things like that. Things like what? What are you talking about? I'm <laughs> sure so you heard the scratching. Scratching? Yeah, the, uh, the house. Mm -hmm. Scratching at night. No. Mm, well, perhaps you're a very deep sleeper then. To take out. Okay. <coughs> what? <laughs> what? Don't get any more. Did you hear any scratching last night out by the warehouse? Was that you? What the fuck? <laughs> look, I'm just, well, look. Sometimes, you know, like, was it? Was it or not? No. Okay. It's not because you're a mouse person or anything. It's just you were the, you were just here. And I thought I would ask you first. Mm -hmm. Definitely had nothing to do mm -hmm. with that you're a mouse person. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Hmm. Did you, uh, what about you? Do you know anything about scratching outside the warehouse? No. Yeah. We were up all night that once, so I don't think that's a thing that happens. Hmm. Otherwise, I would have heard it on it. Okay. Yeah, for the scratching by the warehouse. Wait, there was scratching? I don't know. No, that's what wasn't. Stella says. Oh. Okay, well, I'm glad because I, I sleep out there, so... Oh, boy. <coughs> I mean, it might have been King's <laughs> Hmm. I guess. I'll be fine. Wait. Do you think a shapeshifter took over Cecilia's body and is now inhabiting it, calling herself Stella? Oh, that makes more sense. I could have sworn it yeah. was the sunrise, but, but why? I mean, she's been on about this speaking of which. Just being honest. People have their reasons for things, and I'm not going to question it. Where are you across the side? I was going to say. I guess that's fair. I'm sure the teachers will tell her to change back if it's a problem. Yep. Oh, well. Morning, by the way. It's not great. Morning. All right, where's Solace? We need to get working on some training. Do I need to take you to the medical ward? No, no, I'll be fine. They can't help me at all. If you do need anything, tell me. I suppose if it's just a cough, just you know, keep drinking. Oh, just make sure you get 
start not drying. Would you like me to get you water? No, I'll be fine. I can't. Morning, Solus. Morning. Oh, you completely forgot. Sorry, I didn't recognize you as the new hat. Uh, Captain of L Lumen. Lumen? Lumen, yeah. I I'm really sorry for before. Um, having a really bad day, and I was kind of told to work on my anger for my magic, but um, I I'm sorry for what I said. It is fine, Sala. Is your hair always pink? Oh. Yes, it's always been pink. Huh. Maybe I just missed that. Oh, it looks nice. Mm. Thank you. Mm. Well, I'm going on my morning job. I'll talk to everybody later. Have a good one. Bye, Caleb. Here you go. Um, if you know what team you're getting put on. Mm-hmm. Oh, which team are you can put on then? I'm sticking with Umbra. Mm. Umbra, oh! Nice. I really have no idea which one I'm getting thrown on at this point. Professor came up to me and said that we won't really need it for that whole thing anymore, so I don't know if I'm still with them or if I'm with someone new. Yeah, I don't I know. I'll just wait and see. I would spend that time <clears> to <throat> ask among the captains. Mm hmm. Uh, the captains are the one with the stars day, next to them. Pretty, um, yes, that's pretty important. Mm -hmm. Well, <laughs> that <laughs> Cecilia got lost in the back rooms. <laughs> it's not racist if it's true. Mouse people scratch. That's known. Be seeing you. Have you heard of the High Elves? We won't know who the captain is. Um, I think that has to be developed organically. <laughs> I don't know. I think they're healthy, but they're so bitter you can't eat them. Or uh, maybe, I don't know if they're inedible or what, but I would not advise eating banana skins. But I think some people do. You okay? Hey. Good. Are you? Mm-hmm. I'm good. That is good. <laughs> so, what is this about scratching? I did not hear anything. I didn't hear anything either, but Cecilia, I mean, Stella, I guess, is her name now? Uh, she said oh. that she heard scratching out by the warehouse last night and that it wasn't safe to go around at night. I see, yes. Okay. Hmm. Hmm. Might have to... S s stay out one night and see what is out there? That's a good idea. Yeah. Could make it a team activity. Or, well, I guess we won't be on the same teams anymore, will we? Mm. But we can still work together, yes? Yeah. That sounds good. It's always great. Yes. By the way, what mm -hmm. team are you joining? And Ignis, I believe. Yes. Oh, that's great. You'll be with uh, Mertesh and all those guys. Yes. I need to get to know the other two other than Zuku and Mertesh. Hmm. Didn't get to talk to them much. Fair enough. I think one of them's right there, isn't, aren't they? Speaking of one that I need to talk to, that she has having bad headache. <laughs> oh yes, looking at her own best. <laughs> Take deep breaths. You're absolutely right. <laughs> Sometimes to <laughs> get rid. <laughs> Sometimes Waller, to get rid of headache, look in sky. Look in sky as well. Praise sky helps sun. as well. Look in sky. Praise the sun. Praise the Almighty Praise sun. the sun. Praise, Praise the, the sun. sun. Yeah. Hopefully it'll save me. <laughs> Wait, where's the sun? I don't see the sun. Oh, there it is. It's over there. Oh, oh no. Right. Oh, hi. 
Okay, there should be some mulligan! Maybe there should be some mulligan! Okay, there we go! Would it be better if I look this way at you so you can look at the wall at the same time? Yes, yes. I'll see you around, uh, Doriana. Have fun talking to Ignis. <laughs> I love Muscle Mouse, man. My one regret is that we won't be on the same team. But that's okay. I really... You know what? Fuck it. I'm turning the graphics up. Just remind me to turn them back down for uh, Fractured Thrones, because holy shit. There we go, medium. Ava Pet plays Muscle Mouse. I don't think they do. Or if they do stream, I don't know where it is. I don't know what they... What handle they stream under. Oh, she does stream. Okay. Oh, it's just the same name. Perfect. There you go. Okay. I'm gonna get some training in before the meeting. <sighs> I know we're technically supposed to have a professor here, but they won't mind, right? Okay. <sighs> okay, what is that thing that Solus screams every time he does something? When he does his spell, he screams Firebolt, right? But that isn't necessary for me because I have an affinity? Okay, let's start the simple. Channel the magic. Okay. Hold it. Uh, this feels really weird. Lightning bolt! Hmm. Dang it. How do they do it? <sighs> Just feel it going. <sighs> Come on, stupid hand. Just... Shoot lightning! Uh, uh. Well, I'm not gonna get anywhere doing this. I'm coming back for you, mark my words. Hey, how's it going? Yeah, it's going alright. What, what were you up to? I was just trying to get a little bit of magic training in before everything kicks off. Yeah, that's what I was doing, but I feel like I'm not making any progress. Just doing it on my own, so I was going to come back. 
But if you're going... I get that. Yeah, I was just gonna see how long I can get the whole little fireball in my hand to last, because I think that was on the part of the training. They said, like... Yeah. Push yourself to see how long you can keep the fire going or whatever. Yeah. yeah. Just hold it. Plan, but... All right, then. I'll join you. I guess maybe for your <clears throat> lightning. What are you trying to do? Are you trying to, like, throw it right now, or are you trying to... I want to throw it, but what it doesn't make out of it? it doesn't seem to work. I don't know. It just seems like everyone else can throw it, so it makes the most sense, right? I guess, but, you know, you don't have to limit yourself to that. I mean, if we're all long-range shooting stuff, uh, maybe you could work on something more close-range. You managed to get it flowing through your sword all right, didn't you? Yeah. Uh, well, why not focus first on getting your magic up on that? Uh, be able to get flowing through your sword a lot better than you did before because I imagine that takes quite a bit out of you, right? It's a a big sword you got. I guess so. It's it's no harder than just channeling it through my hand. It just goes through the sword because it's naturally conductive, I guess. Hmm, I guess. Hmm, hmm. Think. What if I could shoot it from the tip? Wouldn't that be cool? Well, maybe. Yeah, that's some sort of, like, <laughs> spell thing you can figure out. <sighs> Wizard people do that kind of thing? They, like, shoot it out from a <sighs> Right? You think so, right? Yeah. You <sighs> think you just gotta... Oh. If you had some sort of... Yeah, because if you've got the weapon to point it, that'd be so much easier to aim it with, right? Because you can pinpoint it. You can... It just doesn't want it. Go! <sighs> Oh. <clears throat> yeah, it's kind of not really sure how to get this to go, to be honest. It's kind of... Oh, you, you, you're right there. You, you need a pen? Nope. No, you probably shouldn't touch it. I just completed the circuit on myself. Oh. Well, uh, I guess it helps having something to say, some sort of enchantment or something. I think that's what they called it. If you got something to chant, as you say, I think it helps with the spell. Like, um... <clears throat> Firebolt! I don't think that went very far, I couldn't really tell, but... Okay. Yeah, point. All right. Having something to yell kind of helps. All right. Lightning hand! The, the electric... Go! Uh, do something! Mm. Ah. Maybe... <sighs> Yikes. Maybe it's worth having to read. Maybe all those books and stuff, right? Maybe we need to find you an actual spell or something. Something someone's already made. Like making your own spell is kind of hmm. a difficult thing to do, right? I guess so. Yeah, that could work. Yeah, that's a good idea. I'll talk to the uh, to Professor um, no, no, Caldwell no. about it. Mhm. Mm I'm sure there's some super basic lightning spell you can learn that just kind of throws it for you. That'd be I was perfect. Told just fireball by the old man, and I'm assuming he just kind of. Well, it seems like a basic spell enough, anyway. Well, it's pretty cool. Oh no. Yeah. I really hope I can get to the point like Bellicosa though. I won't be able to shoot a giant one into the sky and have it keep soaring off. Or some like fire pillar out of the ground like whoosh. That'd be really cool. <laughs> so you have to say an incantation for yours to work? Does that mean you don't have an affinity? Uh, I don't even know what an affinity is, so uh, probably not. Oh. I just kind of yell it because the old man said it helps and... Well, he said to be flashy on the fire in the battlefield, so yelling some dramatic name of a spell kind of helps that. Cool. Also, I guess on a more technical level, he said that it helps me spend time focusing on the magic. If I have to say something out loud, then I don't just try and shoot it out immediately and muck up the spell in any way. I have to sit there and think about it. At least that's what he said, I think. Something, something, it helps. Okay. Hmm. 
Do you know when the sorting ceremony is supposed to happen today? Blah, blah, blah. Uh, I don't know, actually. I imagine kind of earlier on in the day or something, because... Well, I wouldn't want to leave us unsoyed for, like, the rest of the day, right? They want to get us in our teams as quick as possible so we can get to know them and, and they do Rosewood stuff. Hmm. I would think so, yeah. I guess, um... Wait a minute. No, they made a wood. I was thinking it'd be really cool if I could just charge one of these up and throw it. But I think once it leaves my hand, it stops mm. being charged. Mm -hmm. Maybe that's something we gotta work on then. Maybe some sort of way to get a small little item that you can keep charged, but how would you do that? Hmm. Well, I've been thinking about joining the Aether Tech Division. Maybe they could make something there, but... Oh. I don't know. There's other things I have to focus on, like... Diplomacy Team, and I've been thinking about joining Crafting Team, because... Their whole thing is, they're going to be building a, a... A building out there, and... Learning how to reconstruct would be really useful, all things uh, considered. Mm -hmm. Yeah, if we could ever take back that uh, city that was lost, we could really use those kind of skills, huh? Not only that, it's, uh... Well... Um, my home kind of... has a rift in it. Um, I'm sorry to hear. I, you know... It's, uh... It's rough, ain't it? Yeah, uh, I know it's nothing, like, unique. A lot of people have that issue. Uh... But yeah, I figure... That doesn't make it any less bad we all have the same reason we want to get rid of those damn things so i guess that can be our motivation to train to get rid of that damn rift inside your house well not yeah. inside your house where you live also it is inside right. your house in which case that's really bad no it's um there we have these mines uh where my family kind of pulled iron from and it was um rich with aetherite and so uh, uh when the rift started opening up the bottom of the mine kind of fell out, and things just started crawling out. We didn't last very long there. Mm. I getcha. Yeah, I had a similar situation. I'm not actually from... Flens? Flenids. Flenids. I don't know, the big old city in Essex that I'm from. I'm actually from a little bit outside the kind of middle of nowhere. I never actually learned the name of the town, but... There's a rift nearby. Went off. It was a small village, it was almost defenseless, so... The entire thing was lost to it. Sorry to hear that. Ah, it's alright. You know, it is what it is. People lose things. We just gotta make the best of what we got. And I'm gonna make the best of this damn fire magic. Hmm. I'll do the same. But with lightning. <laughs> I'm glad to hear it. Maybe by the end of this, we'll both be like really strong magicians. <laughs> That'd be great. And that's probably the probably the bell. We should probably head back. Yeah, yeah. Can let's get going. Back to the um, warehouse, or I think we're supposed to go to the meeting hall this time. I don't know. Let's just go outside the front of the school and see if there's anyone around. All right. Uh, you want to try a teleporter to be a little quicker? Yeah, okay. Alright, uh, which one is it? It is okay. green one. <sighs> Getting a little bit better at that. A little bit. And we need it back at the warehouse, or are we going in there? Yep. We're going to the we are likely need it at the warehouse. One last time. Alright. Let's go. Uh-oh. Oh, no. That's oh, unfortunate. Yes, uh, no, no. Yeah. So, uh, team have you decided, then? Umbra. Oh, nice. Mm-hmm. I figured, um... I know they kind of have a reputation around the school, but... I don't know. It was either that or Lumen. And... From what I understand, Lumen hasn't failed any of their missions or anything like that. 
And I feel like, honestly, the pressure might get to me. I didn't want to let anyone down because of my uh, lack of, well, uh, ability currently. And I think Lumen, uh, I think Umbra has a lot of potential. Okay. Huh? I mean, I think, I think any team has a lot of potential regardless. I think you're right. From what I've seen, they all, they're all pretty great, so. Yeah, they wouldn't be here if they weren't. I mean, I'm joining Lumen, so, well, I accepted their uh, request. Oh. So now I've got the pressure on me of making sure that we don't lose. <laughs> Congratulations. Good morning, good morning, good morning, good morning. Morning. Good morning. Kiki. Morning, Professor. Luca. Morning, Kingsley. Good morning. If you two could help me gather all the unsorted by the way, how's going to be? Good morning. Too. Um, sure. Yeah. I've been instructed to deliver the unsorted information, so it'd be easier than tracking all of you down. Uh, they should be coming. I think so. Yeah, they heard the bell. Yeah. I mean, I thought it'd be customary by now. Sorted, stay over here for now. Yes, uh, we, have we have the old sort. We have to. Um, uh, we have to oh, get uh, here, yeah. Hey, Caleb. Yeah. <laughs> All right. Uh, Jackson. Oh, yes. Cool. Hey. Uh, Bye. Uh, what's his name? Appreciate it. Huh. I'm, I'm gonna head back to the. Uh, Gil. Gil? Gil? Uh, oh. Gil. Yeah. Yeah. I don't think I've actually met him. Great. His frame, was his frame was sad because uh, they came from Warden's Keep where everyone, you know, died because they're Earth based. And so oh. he made his, he, he made him a, a library for him. He was he, he really touched my heart and I had help out. That's really nice. Oh. Is it behind you as well when you look that way? Uh, it seems to be alright, but I've, like, I've been unable to properly wake up. I keep falling asleep. Muscle Mouse eats our vegetables, ooh woo. I don't know, or something. But I haven't, like, a like, good amount of trouble trying to stay awake. <laughs> Look at the railgun, fuck yeah! Love your streams, thank you, Loka, thank you. Bean, yes. What the fuck's a circuit? Yeah, good point. Whoops. Maybe my my family would know what a circuit is considering. I don't know. Same. Look, if we're facing starvation whenever the professors have a bad day, we may as well be well fed in the meantime. I mean, Probably the one closest to the yeah. store now. Mm. Yeah, yeah. But he's <coughs> already wedding. <laughs> Who are we missing? They would just mention two people like several times over. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Talia. No, wait, she's right there. No. Oh, yeah. Talia is right Sorry, you were right behind uh, Oriana. I couldn't see you. Wow. Sorry. Are you calling Oriana fat, Luca? No. She's just very strong and buff, and and from this vantage point, actually, you're pretty short, Talia. I don't know. I'm not 
Actually, if we're missing anybody from the Nora, then uh, 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 I thought we were the same height. There's 12 of us. I think you're a little bit taller. Who left and the nine is it because of yours? And that's everyone. Mm, nope, I don't think so. Okay. I am really afraid of looking that way now. <laughs> yeah, don't do it. Same. <laughs> I survived. You got it. You're lucky. Well, I think a bunch of the other students yeah, might be able to do it. I mean, it's fine for me. This direction's great for me. Amethyst. It's fine. It is fine, <laughs> but I am very afraid that it can turn straight straight into not fine, and I don't want to knock myself <laughs> out and wait miss the announcement. Don't want to risk your chances. Yeah, that. I don't want to. <laughs> Time to make a death ray. Let's make Tefsa coils, boys. Be allowed to eat again for a day. Mm. <laughs> so what's up with the Cecilia's hair then? Was it always pink? I don't remember it ever being pink. Mm. I don't know. I don't remember. Changed. Honestly, I've seen more people change hair color overnight, so I didn't question it, but, uh... Maybe she stole Ethereum's hair. I mean, it's we've heard business. Ethereum's hair has been changing. If she wants to change her hair color Maybe. and change her name... Ethereum's hair has been changing, Val's hair yeah, has been changing, Yeah, that's... Now changing. Actually, a question I had. Is she Cecilia or Stella now? I think she wants oh, us right. to call her Stella. Are you going to? Oh, new name as well? I guess. If she wants to explain why she's asking for ridiculous things and mispronouncing everything and why I'm supposed to actually, you know, care, then she can tell us. Hmm. Yeah, that's fair. What? Do you owe me one? You said that. Shit as of now. Yeah, I did. She's gonna keep trying to fuck up people's names, oh. and I'm not having that, but she can fuck I should up her not. own name mm. as much as she wants. <laughs> Get some chains, name. fuck yeah, boy. Her toy. Yeah. <laughs> he would lose against Nikola Tesla. Oh, no. Not in a sword fight. According to that. Hmm. <sighs> well. Everyone found their new team then. I've made a decision, yep. Although it was a bit of an eh. except. Sorry about that misunderstanding. Mostly we're just it's mostly just me misunderstanding the situation, so it's all good. Now we wait. And also the miscount. It wasn't my fault. I don't even know about ACDC, what a fucking chump. Oh. <laughs> oh, look, it gets a wallet chain. That sounds like an always sunny in Philadelphia tile card. Is that Murtash? I can't, like, am I getting colorblind? Oh, that is not Murtash. Murtash has the full sleeves. Okay, so I was right, okay. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Luca thunderstruck Nasir. Nasty Nasir. He must have uh, looped around. Bruh. Hmm. Where? On the stairs. We should get seen. Is tell and I can't tell other one. Looks like they had Tal is pretty recognizable. You can just about see him, I think. <laughs> They're not captains though, so who knows? Mm. And then do electric guitars exist? Not yet. <laughs> yeah. uh, Look, Professor, I invented punk rock. Well. Oh, wait, no. 
I invented the power ballad, Professor. Check this out. Will they exist? Well, yes. Um, <laughs> how was everybody's night? Terrible. Whenever I hear Nasir, I'm reminded of that Something. guy in ancient Sumeria that sold shitty copper. Who's that? I don't know this legend. This is great. Bye, soup slug. Good seeing you, bud. <laughs> hey, Professor Bellicosa, you know that sound you've been looking for? Check this out. Puts on sunglasses. Whips out like a dually. Or what do they call them? What do they call the ones that have like the, the two rims? Or the two, um, oh god, I don't know guitar terminology at all. They have like the double necks. I'm on the the hell? Bellicosa would love ACDC, man. Back in black. <laughs> Fuck. Yeah, like Most so people die when they get too cold. It's worse for me. So I'd rather have you to fall asleep instead than then you die, so please. Or do you have somebody with you there? Hey, Soda. She do look like a rock star, legitimately. Look who it is, Mr. Spy himself. <laughs> Later, Soda. Take care. Luca invents Jothrock. You were sitting on a t with a towel. Multi neck guitars? Okay. <laughs> we'll invent the multi neck guitar and then we will invent the guitar. In that order. Well, that's Cecilia. How long are they going to make us sit here? I have training to do. <laughs> Hold on, this headset's like... It is sitting on my head weird. Could have come for a hug. Yeah, I could have come for a hug. I keep offering it in Afghanistan, but she just, they just kept saying no. <coughs> Hello, unsorted. Hello, Chancellor. Good morning, Chancellor. Good morning. Good morning. Today is a very special day for all of you. I hope you are very excited. No longer do you have to uh, sleep with our gracious accommodations here in the warehouse. Wasn't that bad? I've seen those beds. They're pretty bad. Yeah, there are wet beds. It's a bed. It's better it than is a bed. Gets the job done. At least you got a bed. All right. Uh, Professor DeCoy, you could you could have said more beds aside? Yeah, I was going to say. She's over there. I told her to come here and she's not here. Uh -oh. Sure. Thank you. I see her. I think she's fluxing her way here. Very slowly. Well, she should flux her way here a little bit faster. <laughs> the raccoon face? Yeah, I get it. So, That's not how that works, and you know it. <laughs> that is exactly how that works. So, when it comes to sorting, it will be rather simple. You will all follow me towards the dormitory area, and I will set you up. Extremely simple. You will be called up by your t new team captains. And there are some basic questions we will ask. And you will say yes. And then everybody can go to the new home happily. Are there any questions? Yes. No, but, well, sorry. That wasn't sorry. <laughs> the question was just why I was waving, sir. Uh, I'm sorry. All right, since there is no questions, please follow me. Good luck to you all! Please oh. don't scream in my Oh my god, oh god yeah. Alvi. Oh my mm. god, Alvi. Who is, who's that guy? This was one of the few times That's I Avi. wished he was on my Avi. Avi, oh. That is Avi. Hmm.
Oh my god, you're right. Lions live in prides, don't they? <laughs> oh, Lucas' dad was a protagonist today. Oh no. Just like my Japanese animes. <laughs> Dang, Luca, how come your dad let you have five moms? This is short. Can I have everybody, please? Two lines, you said? Okay, yeah, yes, sir. Thank you. Yes. Uh, I'll be one, one, and then you want to be the other one? S starting here. Sure. Oh. I start here, and then starting another there. one here. Okay. Start at the back. Yes. I'll start at the back. Yes. Yes. Uh, let me hit the bell okay. to oh, That's not awkward. <laughs> <laughs> well, oh, I can move forward. Oh. Wait, is this the first or the last in line? No, I don't know. But if I'm second, that's not first. Oh, no! I mean, you're the first to be last. Sorry. Hold on, wait, we have a skin for that. Is it fixed? It's not fixed. <laughs> Never mind. You know what? I don't like <sighs> the fact that all the tears are just kind of staying. It was down. It feels like I didn't sad. notice that. <laughs> I know. Now that you've said it, I can't gonna, not look at it, so I'm going to look at it. Oh, God. These flowers are so beautiful. I don't think we're supposed to draw our weapons here, right? Oh, um, I don't think it was a... Oh, no. Unless they start closing in, I don't think we're okay. I don't think that was the attack, people, Bell. <laughs> I'd rather have my stuff out. They all just start competing us. I'd rather have my us. stuff out before they start closing in. Part of the school, <laughs> part of the crew. Everything will be fine. You guys are incorrigible, <laughs> dude. <laughs> and I'm sorry that we won't be it's able fun. to have you here much longer. Your memories will be held with an SD&E. Wait, what? Huh? Wait, what? Wait, what does that mean? Wait, what? what does that mean? What does that mean? Dying? I'm sorry. I think this is a battle royale situation. I don't even know what she said. I was not paying attention. Did she say thanks for being here? Those that are going to Lumen. I'll remember us. Right. Yeah. How do you feel about your choices now? I'm just starting to regret them. <laughs> purple. purple would have gone much easier with green. Look, if you're really fast, there's still time. Barney, you'll do better. Speaking of green, what <laughs> happened to your hair? <laughs> it's it's green now. Yep. It's actually black. Okay. It's actually black. Like, your hair was, like, at first it was the same color as your glasses, and now it's not at all. How astute of you. What? what does that mean? Well, Umbra isn't out at all. I don't know where the fuck I am. Ventus mm -hmm. is right over there. Uh, I can't well, see him. He's behind me. Ignis is just... Oh. Murtash, Umbra's but, out. I, I don't know. Well, they're there. there. <laughs> Classic Umbra. Oh, no, yeah, they're all there. <laughs> I'm all kinds of fucked up. There we go. Do I feel like I've got a cut here line on my throat right now? Or is that yeah, just my imagination? Yeah, you can see them. Uh, uh, yeah, yeah. Yeah. Hmm. I feel like I have a cut here line on my throat right now, but it might just be my imagination. What's a good playlist for right now? It'll be that in a bit. Huh. 
What's happening? Good morning, students. Good morning. These young men and women before me are alone. They stand before me without true allies. They are without family, without aim, and without clan. It is on this day that they a become rude. a part of your clan and a part of our tribe here at Rosewood. Today you choose your brothers and sisters in arms. You will strengthen them as will they strengthen you. They will stand beside you as you gaze into the abyss. Weapons drawn and unafraid. Can the captain of Aqua come forth? I haven't even met anyone on Aqua yet. Who have you chosen to join your clan in battles to come? Aqua has chosen both Rom Ram and Amari, please step forward. Captain, do you understand your place when it comes to taking responsibility over the lives and actions of those before you? Will you lead them with the wisdom of your station? And do you who have been chosen understand that your words, accomplishments, and failures reflect on the honor and glory of your new squad? Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Then I dub you... Aqua. Please, take your new family home. Lumen, can I have your team captain? Lumen, can I have your team captain, please? And who have you chosen to join your clan in the battles to come? Cadets, please come forward. Captain, do you understand your place when it comes to taking responsibility of the lives and actions of those you have chosen? Yes, sir. And do you swear to lead them with the wisdom of your station? And chosen, do you understand that your words, accomplishments, and failures reflect on the honor and glory of your new squad? Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Perfect. Then I dub you both Lumen. Please. They are yours now. Team Terra, please send your captain forwards. <laughs> Who
Who have you chosen to join you in the battles to come? Um, I, I was under the impression that Solus was uh, available and interested in the Kings of Cathedral. Solus, please come forwards. Hmm. Terra's not a bad pick for him. Captain. Do you understand your place when it comes to taking responsibility over the lives and actions of young Solus here? Yes, sir. And would you lead him with the wisdom of your station? Solus, do you understand that your words, accomplishments, and failures reflect on the honor and glory of Tang Terra? So, yes, sir. That's what I like to hear. <coughs> you may join your new squad in your new home. Team Ventus. Mm, they only got one. They already have the fewest to start with. Captain Daulani. Who have you chosen? to join your clan in the battles to come. I have chosen Talia, Magnus, and Emma Keithman. Talia, Emma, please step forwards. Captain Taulani. Those are good picks too. Do you understand your place when it comes to taking responsibility over the lives and actions of these two? And will you lead them with wisdom befitting of your station as a captain? I will. And do you, unsorted, do you understand that your words, accomplishments, and failures reflect on the honor and glory of your new squad? Yes, sir. I do. Then. Let me welcome you to Team Ventus. Oh, they're gonna make me go last. I don't even see anyone from my team here. Oh boy. Team Ignis. You will be acting as the representative of Team Ignis today? Yep. Everyone else is sick or asleep, so I'm here. Good to know. Who has Ignis chosen to join your clan in the battles to come? We have picked two people to fill our two remaining slots. We have picked those two in the middle. You two, uh, please step forward. Wait, Angio? Hmm? Does the representative of Ignis understand? Do you understand your place when it comes to taking responsibility of the lives and actions of your new teammates? I do. And will you lead them with wisdom? It's the Murtesh way. <laughs> it is the Murtesh way. Unsorted. Do you understand that your words, accomplishments, and failures reflect on the honor and glory of your new squad? 
Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Then go. Martash, please take them to their new home. We're going home. Let's go. Come on. Yeah. Good luck, Oriana. Timambra, please send your representatives. Oh, good. There is someone. Who have you chosen to join your clan in the battles to come? Luca. Luca, please come forth. As a representative of Umbra, do you understand your place when it comes to taking responsibility over the life and actions of Luca? Yes, sir. Will you lead your new teammate with the wisdom befitting of your station? Yes, sir. And Luca, do you understand that your words, accomplishments, and failures reflect on the honor and glory of your new tribe? Yes, sir, Chancellor, sir. Perfect. Then welcome to Umbra, Luca. Thank you. You may take him home. Welcome to Umbra. Thanks. I'll be honest, I couldn't see you guys behind the bushes. I got really worried. Um, oh, um. Oops. <sighs> it's it's us too. Welcome. Looking back was a mistake. <sighs> oh man. Oh, that was a rough one. You okay? No. Yeah, I'm better now. Yep. I'll just I have to try to look back. Too, when <laughs> I got picked. Mm. Well, it's good to be here. Uh, um, you're the only two, you said. What? What is? What did he say? Oh, I don't know. I just heard Tara. Um. Uh, he's looking over here. I think that's you, Ego. Are you, yeah. What do you think it's about? Mm. Not too sure. Uh, uh, could be anything. Uh, hmm. I did see another unsorted out there that hadn't been sorted yet. I wonder if must be oh. picking. That would help our numbers. That. Um, hmm. Uh, do you know who? Uh, Angio. <clears throat> oh, okay. He's a good kid. I've talked to him a few times. I haven't actually said two words to him. What does he do? Does he know magic? Mm, I think he had uh, the medical band around his arm uh and he has a spear okay mm. that actually wouldn't be a bad pick at all yeah a whole bunch of spear users and a mm. sword user yeah i mean if we made a line of spears and shields or even just spears have them on the flanks i could be in the center mm. doing some crowd control 
Or actually, you guys would be doing the crowd, crowd controlling. I don't know. It's a thought. Right. Like a spike ball. Mm hmm. Mm. I like it. Yeah, spears are often most useful on the flanks. Mm. Or on a secondary line. Looks like we might be getting Angel. Alright. I'll put him in the note as well. Do you write everything in that notebook? Um, yes. Just about, um, everything. Can I take a look? Uh, um... Sure. Uh, yeah. This is um just Angelo's Angie. Wow. And there's just a, a whole page of different um students and what they can do. This is really detailed. But uh, yeah. I I try to be. That's good. Um, to know. Yeah. Someone's got to do it. I'm not very good with details. <laughs> well, uh, once they're drilled into my head, it's fine, but up up until then, it's kind of rough territory. All of you. Understandable. Have no... Welcome, Angeal, to Umbra. Hey, Angeal. Oh. Hey. Uh, hello. Ooh. Sorry, we haven't spoken much. Uh, that's fine. I'm much to blame as well. This is your new home. Mm -hmm. um, I guess oh. you could get moved in, uh, pick rooms. Uh, we have a, a party, a, a welcoming party, uh, if you want. Really? Um, yeah, it's mm. nothing big, but uh, we thought it'd be nice. That's really thoughtful. I, I can't remember the last time I had a party thrown for me. That one and the lower one. Hmm. That's true. Great. What do you say? Do you want to bunk together or would you rather have separate rooms? Completely up to you. I'm fine either way. It just it does make more sense to have separate rooms for now. I don't know. We'll look around. And uh, I Is guess get acquainted thing? first. If you need help moving your stuff, let us know. This is all I have. Right. Oh. Yeah, I've already got the weapon oh. back at the warehouse, but I can grab that. It's fine. Okay. Perfect. Uh... Knock, knock. 
quand même. Ah. Il faudra plus facile. Right. Well, I know you've all just gotten most of you to acquaint yourselves with each other just now, but we will need to have a team representative by the end of today. You should talk amongst yourselves and figure who would represent Team Umbra the best. That's uh, since we've Generally. only been using emergency. Sorry. Generally, it is a vote. So please do vote. Mm-hmm. Understood. You're and to just the end to be to clear, that. you unsorted are also eligible to be team captain. Understood. Understood. Right then, unless there are any other matters, uh, that was the only message I was asked to convey. Otherwise, enjoy the rest of your day. If Thank you're you, having Professor. trouble, Thank you, you can come find us. I guess the next first thing um, we have to do as a team. Uh, right. Hmm. Okay. Well. Well, any um. Oh. We do this oh. Right now. Oh. I was going to suggest we wait um, until um we're a little more settled in, and then maybe try and get to know each other, and then we could decide. Yeah, that's pretty good idea. You want to wait till later then. We can do that. Okay. Okay. For now, show us this party set up. Uh, Sounds good. Right. Uh, where did you put the... I'll get the table. I set all the stuff on the table. Oh, okay. Pota pota do we need potatoes? Potatoes. I, I mean, we I can grab the potatoes. Food. I, I think grab, we grab the potatoes. I, I'll get... Oh, yeah. I picked some f from the main hall, and then I set up this little area here to welcome you all to Umbra. Thanks. Do you have a lot of meat here? We baked. There, there, we brought some steak and potatoes. Potatoes downstairs. We actually have to cook the potatoes, but we do have steak. Perfect. I don't need potatoes or anything, but the steak's perfect. Perfect. We also we also baked cookies. They are a little sweet. Very sweet. Hmm. Everybody likes sweet things, right? Sure, I, I suppose. Though, personally, I I I kind of only eat the meat. Okay. It's funny of me. Perfect. Got it. Um, and Jill, do you? You want anything? Uh, oh, I don't know if it's an offer. I wouldn't want to. It's a party. Yeah, well, yeah there's, there's a party. There's plenty of stuff. Come on, Angel. I'll grab you a plate. What do you like to eat? Uh, no, it's fine. I... No, I, I had a, I had enough for breakfast this morning. I'm, I'm fine. You sure? Yeah, no offense, obviously, to you two. I know I was a last minute edition. No. Oh. It may have been last minute, but I mean, we're still all the glad to have you. Yeah. I appreciate it. Mmm. That's really good. Take a little bit longer to get to know you. Yeah, I think we'll actually get to talk to you a lot, don't you? <laughs> what do you do? Uh, in terms of what? I don't know. Do you have combat? magic, combat, experience, anything like that? Well, I use occult magic, but that's really anything special about me. Hmm. What kind of spells do you cast? Uh, nothing yet. I just know how to cast it. The, the magic itself. Oh. So you don't know any spells yet, but you... I, I guess Can't it's an affinity, spells. right? Shroud my hands. Yeah. Um, I won't go into the, the whole backstory behind it. It's really uh, not for the moment. But 
You could say, yes, that is what I was told. Hmm. Well, it sounds like we all have something in common, at least. We're all trying to get better at magic, it seems. That'll give us a pretty good team so goal. I just, wanna... hmm? I actually just want to protect as many people as I can. By getting your magic to be better, right? Well, I actually have tried to just get stronger. I don't mm. know if magic will really do anything for me. Well, from what I understand, magic's the only thing that can take care of a rift beast. So, unless you have some kind of magical artifact, then yeah, magic's the way to go. I thought you could just stab it with a sword mm -mm. enough times that'll... No, not at all. Believe me. <sighs> yeah, no, it doesn't work like that. I had actually spoken to a professor of Tevin, he said no simple weapon could simply just harm a beast, you'd need to use magic somehow. So, I'm gonna try and do something with that, I feel like. Okay. What, mm. what does occult magic do, by the way? Uh, just basically, it destroys, it's... What is good at really? It's. I suppose if you utilize it in other ways, it could just be used as a projectile. But it does destroy. Its main property is destruction, decay. Oh, so you can just like eat away things? I suppose so. This is really cool. I imagine it depends on the material. So that is really strong, right? Occult magic? Uh, yeah, it, you could say. It's pretty strong, I just don't know how to use it mm. too much. Well, I'm well, sure Rosa will help you. It, obviously I can summon it. Yeah, it's part of the reason I came. And so my goal is to conflict the whole magic thing I do. Mm. Mm. I guess that's a good question. So, is it everyone's here to, um, well, in some shape or form, because of the Rift Beasts, right? Hmm. Hmm. So we all want to know how to Actually, kill Rift I think Beasts. Some of us came here for, um, political reasons. People here did in 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 Umbra. Oh, not in Umbra. Oh, you mean like Cecilia? Hmm. Hmm. Oh wait, no. She's called Stella she now. She. Uh, I think I saw her magic once. Uh, wait, no. Did I? Is she really Stella now? Yeah, she's going by Stella. She's pretending like. I, guess identity changed. I don't know. Wait. Maybe she's trying to hide her identity for some reason. Maybe it's something to do with the fact I mean, that she's in the school. Hmm. Wait, if she's a political here for political reasons, she changed her hair and name. <sighs> Caleb, don't write it down. Oh. Uh, uh, right. Okay. She's a spy. Uh, no, she's not a spy. But maybe she's in danger. From a spy. Being targeted? Or something. Something like that. Wait, do you think there's spies in this school? Danger. I mean, there were the rats. I imagine if the staff have a thing where something breaches the barrier. I imagine there'd be some kind of warning. Hmm. Well, I mean, we had a rats here, and I don't... The barrier didn't go off. Huh. Well, one, from what I understand, they're already in the barrier, right? Yeah, they were below. Mm. Oh, okay. So that means they're already within the barrier. Hmm. Because so, Professor Nell, I believe his name was, was the one that set up the barrier, but that means he must have come onto the island <laughs> somehow. Mm hmm. I didn't even know we had a Professor Nell. Me neither. Has, you, has anyone seen Professor Neller? Either of you? 
not today. Um, well, yeah, not today, but I have seen him. He's quite strict. Oh. If I were to describe him. I guess that's a good thing in a school like yeah, this. Where's you got to be if it's in hmm, ministry? Do you have a trash can for all these bones? Um, well, normally, um, we eat the bones. Um, you can put you the eat bones the, in there. Wait, you eat the bones? I'll eat them later. Well, I eat bones. You do? Hmm. Why? I guess because I can. I mean, I, I just, I normally eat fish whole. And they have bones. Well. Wait, but do oh, you like no bones? bones? Well, they usually have little bits of meat on them, so they're somewhat tasty. So wait, why don't you just eat some meat then? Well, because I eat, I eat the whole thing, so I normally don't have bones. You know what? Abby might like bones. Save a bone for Abby. Okay. <sighs> that was delicious. I need to try that out. I'm glad you enjoyed it. Thank you, guys. Angela, you really should try some of this. They have, like, cookies and stuff, which I don't eat, but if you like cookies, you should have a cookie. Uh... <laughs> You know, I, I'm, I'm, I think I'm good for now. I'm just, no, again, no offense, but if I get hungry later, then I'll, I'll, I'll maybe. Mm -hmm. Of course. Normally we don't have food here, so I mean, we have food here now. <laughs> I think I'll be fine. Um, what division? Uh, did you join uh, any? Um, I'm kind of be three, between three of them right now. I can't really choose. Um, for one of them, I'm thinking for sure I'm going to be in Diplomacy Squad. Uh, and then, uh, it's between Crafting and Aether Tech. Oh. Uh, hmm. Okay. We're quite the division. Hmm. Understood. What divisions are you guys in? Um, hmm? um, farming slash hunting. Farming and hunting? Do you have any secondary mm -hmm. divisions? No. I think I should focus on just one. Okay, that makes sense. That's fair. What about you guys? We're both in farming. Oh. Well, that makes sense. You're medical? Yeah. It... Yeah, I only chose the one. Okay. Oh. Still really useful. Yeah, we still have somebody medical on our team. Our yeah, that's really good. <clears throat> hmm. Kalen was telling me you fight with a spear. Ah, uh, right. Yeah. Uh, it's in the warehouse. I don't have it on me currently. But, yeah. Um, just out there, I think, the other day, Nella made me fight Gil, get some invites out. Yeah, you know how that went. Hmm. I don't know how it went, actually. I, I oh, you weren't there? Hmm. That's odd. I'm pretty sure Nella had requested everyone. Be that might have been when I fell asleep under. I mean, I'm, I was busy. Oh, right, of course. Right. Busy. You were busy. Uh, uh, training. Hmm. Guess we weren't allowed to sit that night. Yeah. Okay, yeah, I fell asleep under a tree. I'm sorry. It's fine, so long as no one else knows. Or oh, someone wants to be listening right now, which I presume they're not. I don't think so. Wait, the no sleeping was a real thing? Mm-hmm. No sleeping and no sleep. eating yesterday. 
very real. I mean, I can understand the whole eat no eating thing. They barred Murtesh from eating, but sleep thing? Well, it was only going to be no eating, and then, um... And then, uh, Solus mouthed off to a teacher, and so they were like, Okay, now you're not sleeping either, so... That's how that happened. You didn't... You didn't, like, punch Solus in the stomach, right? No, why would I? No, we, we just told him to stop, which he did. <clears throat> and so he continued. Mm -hmm. Oh, thank God. Yeah. People have been threatening to punch Solus in the stomach. That's probably that why. Sure. No, I don't think anyone punched him yet. I should probably warn him. That Someone might be a good idea. Hmm. I, I mean, I think even the professor said that, like, if Solus uh, used fire magic or if it was misbehaving, that you could just punch him in the stomach. And oh. you would not. You could just do it that you wouldn't get punished. Well, there was a thing about sleepwalking because we hadn't. It was our first night. We didn't know if he sleepwalked or not. And there was a firework stand in the warehouse. So we tried to make sure he didn't you know, sleepwalk and use his magic whilst sleepwalking. Can I ask you guys a weird question? Yeah, just as an aside. Just... Hmm. Do you know why there are trebuchets and catapults on the second floor? And how did they even get them up there? Oh, yeah, good question. I. Yeah, they're like right in front of the stairs when you go up the, on the warehouse. It's really weird. Like, did they assemble them up there? Did they magically have them brought in? They must have brought them in. I don't remember. We Did we have catapults five months ago? Mm, not that I can remember. Those must have been new. Why are they storing a bunch of catapults around the school? That's really weird. Maybe hmm. to get places quicker. Like if you put somebody in the catapult and you like fling them, maybe they'll go farther. We and that way they don't have to that. walk all the well, <laughs> so time. Okay. That was Lafron. That was Lafron. Not the catapult. What? <laughs> what? Oh. Yeah, I want to. We... This is an odd. Out of context thing. We had an idea of um, throwing a student in a box, and then um, we actually tried it, and she got hurt, and we got in trouble for it. Um, but she's fine now, so it's it's okay. You you put someone in a box on a weapon, and didn't expect them to get hurt. Oh no, it wasn't a weapon. Um, we got another student. The front could be counted as a weapon. He is oh. really big. Oh, the front's throw. Okay. Hmm. Oh, regardless. We didn't. We didn't know she'd get hurt that bad. I thought it was a good idea of just getting places quicker. Right. How far could Lethron really throw, though? Well, hmm. I've heard it was pretty far. Um, Wait, don't we have teleporters? Yes. Yeah, but I was gonna say the same. But... <laughs> They're not everywhere. And so, if you have your teammate right beside you to just throw you, it could be a good um combat advantage. Um, I don't know. I I, I doubt that. Like a Viking yeah, sling? Someone would uh. <laughs> A Viking sling? <laughs> you just make a big old take piece of, uh, uh, like a bag, cut it in half, and then you just put the Viking in the middle, and then you... <laughs> <laughs> you know? I... You writing that down? A Vikapult. A Vikapult. A Vikapult. Yes. <laughs> it might come in handy. Make sure it's on your list of things to not do, otherwise... Someone will get hurt, and that's the opposite. Someone you don't want to get hurt will get hurt trying to hurt someone else. 
Isn't that what we call their list? We write everything down that we want to do so that we don't do it? Yes. <laughs> yes. Exactly. Right. You have a list like that? Mm. I want to yeah. read it. Eventually. Oh, mm, okay. Sure. I feel like I'm already learning a lot about you guys. I have to cross that one now. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, did you end up doing one of those? Mm, no. Uh, we were close to doing it, but um, we don't have uh, members anymore, so we can't do a few. Oh, okay. Hmm. <laughs> yeah. Um, you're you're our new members because yeah. we yep. don't have a few anymore. I'm guessing the um, the other two that you had are are have been shipped off on the wide open seas back to their homeland or something. Or wait, did they die in a horrible accident? Uh, Was it a horrible magic related accident? Well, okay, I saw the them first the other day, so team I imagine member I the did, keys. but. Um, the other two, no. Wait, you had a team member that died from a horrible accident? Uh, yeah. She was, um, a dragon named Aki. Um, me and her went on a mission, and there was a giant worm, and it sprayed us. Um, I, I came out okay, but she didn't, and a few of the other students oh. perished as well. Yeah, I heard about that. Sorry to hear that. Um... Well, um, do you want to show us the rooms? Uh, yeah. yeah. Let's move sure, away sure. from the, uh, the, the death topic for now. Hmm. Mm. Well, let me get one more piece of meat. Oh, that sounds good. So this is, this is the, um, bathroom? Okay. Right. You guys know how to use that, I think. Um... And, and, and we're walking, and, and we're walking. Uh. Yep. <laughs> <laughs> I love it so much. Empty room. They, they, yeah. they didn't take. A... Yeah, it's. The you could room. be there. Perfect. I guess let's take a look. Oh. Lovely view of a bits. cliff face. Yeah, it, mm. it rocks. <laughs> huh? Oh, I get it. That was like a play on oh, words. It rocks. Yeah, That's pretty okay. funny. Oh, uh, yeah. R right, I, I did that. <laughs> I love Caleb, dude. Sure. I know where I am. I'm going the way. So that's pretty much this room. Um, okay. Room number two. And another room. Oh, this one's bigger. Oh, it is bigger. There's so much room oh. for activities. Look, there's even like a little changing thing. This, this is, is neat. Do you want it? Oh. Uh, I'll let you pick first, Angel. It's neat and oh, all, but it doesn't I, matter to me. I really don't mind. Hmm. Hmm. Well, we do have one more room. Oh? Right, the best room. Mm -hmm. The best room. Best room. Mm. Come on. Hmm. Basement? No, dungeon. D dungeon? Dungeon. Oh, well. It's a bit... 
This is by far the biggest room. Oh. Yes. Huh. It's not much of a dungeon. It looks more like a storage room. Well, it's in the process of... Yeah. We have a few, um... Written out things. Like what? Mm. Well, uh... I don't think we should... Say yet. But we're team members. I'm... They are right? team members. We probably should. If it's a... Well, if it's secret, you don't have to say. You shouldn't be keeping secrets between team, team members, to right? Themselves. Well, it's oh, not really a secret, it's just... We'll, we'll talk about it later. Um, other things. Conversation topic for another time? Right. Okay. Build suspense. Suspense. So. Mm. Mm. Alright, so, um... Those are the rooms. Um... Can, what are you doing? Right. That's one of the things we can um, do. We can an exercise. exercise. Oh. Perfect. That'd be great to have our own little training facility. That's, that's smart. Somewhere we can uh, pump and then iron. There's also room down here. For what? <laughs> Anything. Um, we could open it up and a pool maybe. Right. A pool? Looks kind of dank down there. Really dark. Uh, and maybe with some light, <laughs> make it into a pool. Wait, do all the other teams have a basement? I mean, a dungeon? Uh, I'm not sure. Or a whatever you call it. Fitness room? I I, I, doesn't Aqua just have the pool in the backyard? They have a backyard? Did you not see their pool? No. Uh, they, have a, they have a whole pool back there. <laughs> that sounds neat. So this would well, be suppose, the perfect uh, place to create a pool. That Aqua or something and it's water. Pool of water, so that makes sense, I suppose. Unless there's Ooh. a reason behind it. What about like a like an artificial hot spring? You could like take off the grate. It that you can shovel coal into, and then heat it up um, from underneath. Your voice. It sounds like you're speaking from all the way over there. Really? But like you're still here. You clear your voice a little bit. How do I do that? You're you did using that work? the wrong mouth. Weird. Okay, let me check. You wore the wrong mouth today. I, I think you're speaking from your boot, not your. What about now? Your head. There you go. That's the right mouth. Perfect. Mm. I didn't know I had two mouths, but. You learn to speak in voice. You learn something new every day. Mm. Oh, that oh, reminds nice. me. I need to remember to finish to teach you um what the what yeah he knows the a what. language okay. it's called what it's, it's like speaking through your gill wait mm. can you learn that if you don't have gills uh -huh. i i don't know I, we're gonna find out that sounds fun uh yeah I'm sure you valuable language. As well. Does Mordred know? What? <laughs> I wonder if Mordred does know what. <laughs> well, if he's a we, we linguistics professor, I imagine he has a vast knowledge on many different languages. Hmm. Hey, when do we get oh, our uh, uh, our colors? Oh, the uniform change. Um, tomorrow they should give you your uniform, and then you'll be able to just... Oh, perfect. Or you could ask them. They might have it ready for you, but... Hmm. If not, then 
Tomorrow they'll give you your colors. Neat. Right. I guess you two can choose which room you want now. All right. Rock, paper, scissors, uh, and the winner guess? picks first. I guess so. All right. On the count of three. We'll do it here. Upstairs. We'll do it here. One, two, three. Rock, paper, scissors. I lost. Okay, oh. you pick first. All right. Well, which one don't you want? Um, I don't know. I kind of like being up high. All right. Well, then you can have the high one. Well, I, okay. I guess that makes sense. Sorry, we were just discussing what? rooms. What? Uh, Kalen jumped down? I think he went back up. Kalen jumped down here? Alright, that's the rooms decided. I should think we decided on rock, paper, scissors. Mm hmm. So, you will get. It's very simple. That one up there. Yeah. And then I'll be down here. Perfect. Yeah, uh, be careful. You, what do you mean? Oh. I am being careful. No, I know. Just you're on the banister, so just be careful. Yeah. Oh, all right. <laughs> it's a great vantage I mean, point. If you like looking over high places. We also have a balcony. <gasps> I like that. I assume that's upstairs and around there. Mm -hmm. We used to have an attic, but uh, they got rid of them. <clears throat> Probably because we kept on hiding in them. Hiding in the attic. Was safe. <laughs> it was safe. <laughs> Piano cat meme <laughs> with Luca. So now what? I miss the attic. Are they our rivals? Should we go over there and shake our fist at them? <laughs> well, I wouldn't shake out this. Actually, me and Murtesh, we have another side team. Like, th this is my team, but we have a side team called Team Yesh. <laughs> so, I mean, Cause it's I think we're allies. Oh. Yesh. Yes. <laughs> yes. 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 I think I remember you speaking about that. Uh, Hi, Agnes. Can everybody get the his uniform? Oh. Hello. How are you doing? Are you enjoying hey. the new... Want a hug? <laughs> a hug? Oh, you go. Hi, okay. Luca. Hi, Luca. Hi, Angie. Um... Hey, look, aren't these balconies I great? You, Luca. I'm not going to jump. No, hi, up. I don't think that's ah, a good idea. You. I don't know. I'll catch you. Nico, do you want hug? I'll catch you. You I... sure? Yeah. Why do you keep wanting to give me a hug? You go in and discuss plans. Oh. oh my god. Plans about what? The secret. Oh, secret? Yeah, our secret. You want to discuss secret plans? Which? What secret? The one with only us. The one with the hole? Is it a team? The whole thing? plan's gone! We know more hole, we have to figure it out a different way! I have an idea! Caleb, do you no, I meant the whole plan is in the entire plan, not the whole plan. <laughs> I thought you meant the secret plan about the hole! I feel like we kind of should stick with our N team. What? Are you, do you want to talk about the whole plan or the whole plan? Orion, I'm coming down for that hug! Okay. Now jump, I'll catch you! I'm not gonna jump! <laughs> how, how did you not find the holes? Hi. Well, I, I, it just, I looked everywhere! Uh -oh. You look good in red! I mean, do Thank you, you. you guys have a dungeon? 
en esa... Squeeze. Oh, oh. Squeeze. Oh, Wow. All They right, just really huh? gained some muscle with you guys. Yeah. The tree. Oh. Okay. Everybody else no, is just dead. between us. <sighs> just Mitish. Luca, you really need to okay, no, lift no, three fun. more. Mm. What do you mean? Yeah, I think you're right. We just put something there. Or you can try to lift me like three. Like a ten? Okay, let me try. How heavy are Sorry. you? <laughs> Hell yeah, let's do it! <sighs> we have to get a tent, okay? <laughs> That's our secret plan! <laughs> Will do. You really dance for a mouse. How are you two doing okay. there? Huh? He's trying to pick me up because he's trying to gain strength. I already feel so much stronger. Good on you. Thanks. <laughs> right, um, where'd you guys get your team uniforms already? Mertish! What? Oh, Midori dropped them off. Mertish! Who dropped them off? You guys didn't get yours. Huh. And Midori, you guys didn't get yours? Uh-uh. Uh we didn't get anything. Wait, is there a package out front I from Midori? Like Kingsley! What the hell Lumen's got? Mertish! I knew it went back! I imagine if Madari went around dropping up the packages, we would have seen it. You can't just call girls dads. Okay. I think with that, if you uh, ask for your new uniforms, <clears throat> you can probably don them. Great. Then let's go talk to a teacher or a Madari or something and it's, see if we can get ours. Yeah, check in with someone. Uh, there's um, sure. two over there. Okay, let's go talk to the teacher. Can they be busy? I'm sure it'll be okay. We just have one question. Right. You don't mind me asking what are you doing? Breaking down this wall. Well, oh, that wall's broken down. Breaking down we're taking house. out the old and we're going to be setting new eventually. We have a question, professors. Um. Do you know where the Umber uniforms yeah. are? They weren't already the in there? Should have, yeah, the Madari should have taken them into the dorms. Is it in like a small oh, package? Is it in like a- is it already in the rooms? Is- are they hanging up somewhere? They should be in small packages near the front door. If it's not, the Madari may have hid them. Hmm. Alright, let's have a look. It's like an- I'll give the dorm a good once over. It's like an egg hunt. I guess it's your first mission to find your clothes. <laughs> you can't just call girls dance. <laughs> right. If I were a Matari, where would I hide a package? Probably in the fireplace. Hmm. No, I don't see one in the fireplace. Wait a minute. Hold on. How did they... <laughs> There's something up here. <laughs> just, just the one? I only see one. I'll keep looking then. Unless there's two in there. Let me know if there's two in there. I'll take another look. No. No luck. Uh, go ahead. Have a look. <laughs> Slash RP find clothes. Nope. We're gonna turn this place upside down. Come on, Angio, with some force. Is that it? Oh. Huh? oh, you found I, I it. Think, is it? Is it? Yeah. Is that it? <laughs> just write this. Yeah, the same. yeah just. We don't want to make too much of. Well, don't make a mess at all. It's at first. Damn. You're right. That was probably a bad move. Okay. 
Well, I'm gonna go put mine on. Suppose to the rooms to change. Uh, <laughs> all right. Be down in a bit. I was down here, I believe. Uh, okay. Sure, there was. Uh, yeah. To the right. Uh, yeah. Okay. Window room. These bits are so much better than the ones in the unsorted room. Okay. Where is it? This looks pretty good. We even got the bootstraps. <laughs> we got the drip, fellas. <sighs> oh, I gotta check for FT meetings. What a good time. Drip obtained. <laughs> okay. We're in. Hey, this outfit looks pretty good. Whose eyes are popping? Oh. Oh, wow. Yeah. Um, yeah, that's a good fit. Oh. Thanks. Nice uniforms. Yeah, we oh, found them. Really good on you guys. Yeah, we found the hidden. The one was hidden there, and then the other was in the fireplace. Yeah, one was in there, and one was in the fireplace. Oh, that's another good thing I should probably remind you of. Don't burn any wood in the fireplace. Um, we don't know where the mm. smoke will go right now. Do we not have there's a... No, uh, there's no chimney? There's no chim... There's no chimney. Oh. Yeah. Well, then where does this hole go? Burning wood for the sake of burning wood. Well, I imagine it goes through here for a chimney to be connected. Hmm. Okay. Well, I won't burn anything. Yeah, I'm not gonna do anything with the fire, so don't worry. I mean... Okay, good. Good. Hmm. Anyways, congratulations, I think that was your first mission. Mission um, accomplished. You your clothes. We now have an undefeated streak. For completing missions. I suppose so. Yeah, uh... That's the task of being a number, I guess. Gotta start somewhere. With many more to come. Yeah. And what more else is there to do before we eventually vote on this leader? Hmm. Well, I think a good thing would be to see how two of you well can fight. Or how you fight, I guess. Yeah, of course. To the training ground, then? To the training ground. Uh, yes. Awesome. Sounds good. I remember <laughs> they made you guys I almost did um, it. all fight each other, but um, I was having a lot of issues with Murtesh and beating people with a bat. Uh, wait, what? So I didn't get really... What? <laughs> I didn't really get to see much of you guys fighting. Murtesh beat you with a bat? No, 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 no. We were going to beat other people with a bow. That. Staff? Oh. Bow staff. staff. Bow staff. Oh. oh. Bow staff. Oh, okay. Oh, what was that? Cecilia? I mean, Stella? Where'd you come yeah. from? Yeah. yeah. I, I've, I've been here the whole time. You were in the dorms when I was changing? No. <laughs> what? 
You said you've been here the whole time. Yeah, when you were leaving. Oh, okay. Well, we're just gonna go to the training grounds and uh, like, test our metal. If you wanna... Mm -hmm. I don't know if you're up to anything. Is this is where I like... I... Share, share. Is this like where I go... <laughs> go to people's dorms and with the unsorted uniform and ask to join their team or something. Make it look like I was like kicked out. I don't think you'd fit into my <laughs> uniform though, but that'd be funny. No, I'd have to get it like hand tailored like this one. Yeah, Only the, the finest uniform. of the materials, yes. But your uniform looks just like ours. I, I know. Is it a different material? Yeah. But it looks just like ours. I know. So, it's, it's, it's the same me. material. Is that a point, Ali? No, it's not the same material. So wait, then you just spent a, a lot material. of money on a thing that looks just like the stuff that we're wearing? Well, uh, otherwise I'd get yelled at <laughs> if it didn't look like what you're wearing. Yeah. Well, yeah, but why not just get the normal ones then? Well, why is it... Because yeah. I, I don't fit it. <laughs> oh, oh, okay, um, let's go to the training grounds. grounds. <laughs> training grounds. <laughs> Hey, how's it going? Oh, sorry to intrude. Oh, what? Oh, 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 we're getting oh, flushed. Oh, God. <laughs> These things are dangerous. What yeah, if we tried to warp at the same time that you did? Would we fuse? Yeah. Probably. Yeah? Uh, probably, yeah. I imagine if you met. I have to write that one down. If we were to go to the point where they came from, I'm gonna imagine we'd meet halfway or something like that. Oh, man. I don't want to use the teleporter anymore. We um, yeah, I, I'm, I'm going to walk. We almost did it. <laughs> yeah, let's walk. Uh, it's <laughs> fine. Just act Teleporting. unpredictably. Oh, we can just walk it twice. Oh god, time. I've just had the horrible thought. Let's all walk together. I've just had the horrible thought of what me and Ika would look like combined into one person. What do you think that would look like? I'm terrified. Do you think you'd get- it would just be like, you, but with shark fins, or would it be...? Uh... I mean, I would definitely have his, like, his- his features, he- uh, the freckles would stay, the ear things, those are ears, right? Or are those, like, <laughs> lung <laughs> flaps? Uh, other ears, okay. What? Bellicose is at the main right? school building now. Uh, what, sorry, what are lung flaps? Okay. What? I think I see her. Um... That's Sorry, a... we were discussing what would happen if we Hold if on, we wait. both took the teleporter at the same time and Hold merged on, into one being. <laughs> there you go. Oh, thank you. No oh, problem. Can become enlightened if it happens. I think it's the, the fault um... of the teleporters. Sometimes you just your gravitational yeah, pull is adapted. Oh, his ears, your freckles. Uh, Has anybody eyes. seen Aqua? I lost the tail. Mm -mm. Oh, uh, would tail? Yeah, tail. Except it'd be red. Um. Hi. Both your rocks, uh, your uh, your necklace, your your highly detailed hands. <laughs> what do you mean, my high? These are regular hands. <laughs> I don't know what you mean. Now you go, you go. Uh, oh you, God! Uh, <laughs> oh no! I feel like your hands have more. Your hands are pretty callous. You must work out a lot. Yeah, they go. They go. Yeah, I'm hands. always using my hands. You're pretty good too. It's not saying you hitting people with it. <laughs> you see your hands you go. Do you have like a disease? <laughs> That's supposed to be a scar. Um. Oh. I thought you were. I thought you had like like scurvy. <laughs> <laughs> oh, What's scary. scurvy? Baby's your... seasick thing. Baby Z cows. Thanks for your seasick. Yeah. Yeah, they eat, they eat on boats and shit. I've I've never gotten scurvy before. I actually never like eaten before. Well, oh, I, I I like riding on boats. How often do you ride on a boat? Wait, are we still wanted over there at the well, main not building? Very often. Were you guys end up going somewhere like important? Did we stop you? We should probably keep going. We have to go talk to Nikosa. Oh, yeah. It's going to the training ground. Mm-hmm. Uh -huh.
I mean, are we yeah. also <laughs> go to the main building? I... Uh, well, we're yeah. looking for Bellicosa. How about we start walking? Sure. Let's walk. Uh, yeah. yeah. <laughs> you know, you'll stop off earlier than we will, and we'll just keep going. Yeah, we're worry. just gonna, you know, we just need to talk. So... Hello. No. It's that one. All right. Uh, let's keep it's going. I'll talk about it in a second. Once he's once he's out of your shadow talk. He's following. Mm -hmm. I don't know. Why is the Madari following? He probably you? smells all the meat on my hands from when I was eating a bunch of meat with my hands. Did you? Oh. That could be it. Man, Gellov, what was that story about you eating a cat hole? I mean, I oh, know, I didn't, oh. I don't, I don't. Well, I mean, like, first of all, it, it was, it, um, it wasn't a cat. But like, it, um, there. it was, it was more like a hole. Wait, where? Ah. Uh. Right. And so we'll go on our way. Oh, okay. In real good academy right now, so best that you step up to the task, yes? And I assume really? you will take good care of the new assortment. Mm -hmm. yeah. I have the sudden feeling that we were supposed <laughs> to meet with a teacher, but uh, we didn't I know, we have a teacher. teacher to meet with us. Hmm. I mean, Professor Takuya talked to us, but I mean, that was about having to vote for me. Uh, so I suppose Takuya and Skate were the professors if we were supposed to meet any. Though at the same time, we met Caldwell outside. <coughs> oh, yeah. I wonder what that building is going to become. Are we getting a new school? I wonder. Maybe something useful. Well, I mean, there used to be, <clears throat> but, um, me and Nertish, we wanted to build a new headquarters there, but I guess there's no hole. Uh -huh. Wait, why do you need a hole? Well, I have heard that, because you were screaming in. As always, well, the we had the brilliant idea of if we it. took our headquarters and we put it underground, nobody would find us. And then we could do all of our Team Yesh stuff in private. What does Team Yesh do? Do just about everything and anything Team Yash can do. Really? With two, with the two of us together, we can become. We're, we're gonna become the new best team. That's hmm. what we're gonna do. Sounds like you've got your hands full with that. Um, I wish you luck. Sounds like you're busy, I suppose. Will that get you in trouble with the teachers, though? Um. I mean, we haven't told any of the teachers about Team Yash yet. Oh, it's a secret. Bring it up. Well, okay. Uh, I imagine right now, if anyone has heard of it, I presume it's been taken as a joke. Team Yash is not a joke. Sounds like. <laughs> we're just... We're the underdog. We have right. yet to prove ourselves. Hmm. I think that's what we're all here to do, right? Hmm. Well, I mean, aside from trying to make Team Yesh the best, I do hope that Umbra becomes the best team. That way none of us get hurt. Hmm. Wow, there are a lot of people here. Yeah, I wasn't expecting that. Ventus and, uh, Terra. Cool. So it seems. Well, I guess since Terra's over there, we can just practice over here. Sounds good to me. That, hmm. that, the Madari's still following yes. us. So you need... Just anything? Yeah. No. No? I was no. going to save this for yeah, later, but you. here. It's a little piece of a steak. Yeah. 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 Don't tell the teachers. Eat it quick. <laughs> don't leave the bug anymore. Okay, oh, let's fight. That, I, I imagine it was the meat that it smelled.
Do you all want to... Move that, right? Yeah, just grab a weapon over there and then... You two fight. Okay. I have to warn you, though, I've been training with a sword for, like, nine years. Ten years? Nine or ten years. Oh, well... Ten years? Uh-huh, since uh, I was ten. Wow. Well, fair play then, because I've already done two years. If you can even call it combat. No wonder why you knew so much. Mm-hmm. I was drilled into me uh, at a very early age about all kinds of things like battlefield tactics and stuff, but I've never actually had the chance to use it in practice. I've sparred, but I've never actually been, you know, on a battlefield. Hmm. I mean, it's not too much different. I mean... Except now... Oh, this game. Right, except now that you have a team with you. Perfect. Like compared to what I'm used to, but... Okay. I imagine nothing lethal. First to three. Nothing lethal. First to three. One second. Mm-hmm. Okay. Good to go. Whenever you're ready. I tend to forget to block no, low, so feel free to use that against me when I forget. Yeah, I think most people do. Bearings back for two minutes. <laughs> ah. Okay. <sighs> Quick breather and. I was tired of getting balked on the head all the time. <sighs> if you'd like, well, I could show you some blocks. On the head. Yeah, my my teacher he would he wouldn't use a spear or a sword. He'd just take a stick out, a training stick. He'd give me the real thing and tell me to strike him. Of course, you know it was blunted, <laughs> but still, I don't think I actually got a hit on him until I was like 17. And even then, that still was a rare occurrence. It must have been pretty freaking it's not powerful then. Too much of a self mm. quest. Could I see Pichu fight the pre? You know the. Of the two? Oh, would you like us to fight? Oh. Um, yeah, I just, just sort of know what I'm working with. I, yeah. I'm, now that we're actually like a I'm team. Hmm. Hmm. Let me go get my weapons done. 
Hulk and BD Demon. Hello. No worries, Sai. We're in Umbra. We got our boy Angel here, other unsorted that got uh, sorted with us. And now we're just testing our metal. All right, Caleb. All right. What do you say we follow their rules? Three hits? That sounds good. All right, whenever ready? you're ready. Let's go, Caleb. Don't forget about your feints. Try not to get stabbed in the throat this time, too. Okay. Uh, do you want to do a spa? Or do you this time. Yeah, sure. That's your choice. Um, I'm sorry. I Remember, go high and then low. Alternate. Congratulations on your new team, Luca. Thanks. Uh, uh, thank you, Professor. Mm, you don't have to bow to me. Uh, okay, Professor. The shield's in the way. Try and faint it out. Ready? <laughs> Already training them hard, I see. Oh, we just all wanted to kind of get an idea of our abilities. But that is the plan, yeah. I think... Since we're all kind of uh, fresh on the magic spectrum, it's better to try and evolve the strengths that we can do, at least for now. Hmm, I understand. Sorry, I need to. Well, I'll you to it. Thank you, ma'am. Yes, I've felt that pain before, so I understand your sentiment. I would treat you more actively if I could feel my arms right now. But, uh, yes, it looks like this. So, when you help. Uh, when he jumps, try swiping instead of just blocking. So much more better. Not exactly me for manual labor, well. Okay. Looks like it's put a lot of pressure on you, on your back, your hips. You should take it more than you Yeah. He keeps attacking high. You have to teach him some low attacks. Ready? <laughs> There you go. Good stuff. I like that a lot. Oh my gosh. Uh, to Bit of practicing on that dimension. Oh, Good job, guys. Thank you. So there's three spears and one sword. Hmm. Hmm. Yeah, I'm thinking for a formation, what would be good is, since you have a shield and you're kind of low range, if you and I are in the middle of a formation, we can... We have a pretty good view of the front. I can cover uh, whoever's on my left flank and your offside, in case anyone gets stuck on your shield. Uh, and then if there's two spears on the sides, it's good for flanking, so if we... We can either pincer them out, or have the mm. flanks facing outward, and then they can watch our uh, immediate sides. 
But uh, with such a limited amount of people, it's it's hard to say whether a battlefield would look more like a I brawl than anything else. Four of us, if we were to, to go in alone, I imagine you in the center with a sword, and us three behind, or maybe even you at the front in front of him with, with the shield. Hmm. Uh, what if we were both in the so front? Much, on the spear and then until... you guys were on the back sides, kind of like a like a wing or a V shape. My only concern with that is I mean, normally swings. I am put up at the front. True. Hmm. And if you were to we could have our own formation a little bit with our numbers. Hmm. Kind of like a like a bowl, a reverse bowl. I need more info. We, we Us two at the front. Hmm. Caleb and Jill kind of behind it to the side. Yeah, like the like a like what I was saying, right? Like a V, yeah, yeah V or work. a bowl, yeah, yeah. Here, get right here, uh, and then just see what it looks like. I'll stand here. Just imagine I have my. Let's see Spring for my swings. It's not bad. I just have to be more mindful hmm. of my Excuse right me. side, but. I think one thing to keep in mind is yeah. also magic. Is yeah, the best to use it. but I don't think any of us are really good at magic yet. I mean, the only thing I can do is charge up my sword with um, electricity or my hand. Um, you can shoot water though, right? Hmm. Yeah, I have been trained to shoot water. If you can get everyone in front of us soaking, then maybe my electricity magic will be stronger. And maybe conduct. That's true. It can flow through all of them. Mm. I'm enjoying some hot nudes right now. It's not bad. They're very spicy. Yeah, I like that idea. Can you I have the magic? Really work. I don't believe I asked earlier. Uh, no. Well, I can't spell yet. Uh, hmm. Okay. Yeah. So we have two magic I users that can't cast yet, and then... Electricity could work. Yeah, I think there's what a lot of good synergy name? there. My name? Yes, I'm talking to you. Uh, oh, sorry. Uh, but, uh, I am Angel. Mm, I need last name for that. Angel Weiss. Right. And what is it that you do? Um. Well, I have a cult magic, and I fight with a spear. Care to show me? The spear. I'll look at your magic, and now's the time. Uh, let's quickly grab a spear. We actually just missed his fight. Hmm. Come again? Any hmm. volunteers to fight him? I just fought. Do either of you want to fight? Don't have my Alright. Alright, I'll fight again. Uh, I mean, I could always demonstrate on the dummies and if that would work. Mm, just a quick live one, I suppose. Uh, Wait, what? First of one, I suppose? Just sure, first of one. I'll let you go first. Rich. Good thing. This is my grip. <laughs> no, this is a wall. I think that would be effective, yeah. These walls. Considering that uh, Lika does not like using his magic. Right? <laughs> <laughs> Alright, let's go free. No, uh, not yet. Oh, good
I do too. Well, I think, well, Bellicose is nice. Always come back injured in one way or another. I didn't. Mentally, physically, or emotionally. That's not true. I didn't get injured last time that she just actually, wait. Mm, yeah, never mind. It's called hazing. Let's talk right? to her and I'm perfectly fine. It's, I know. It's like when I told them that they're going to <sighs> after the tree incident. I know that will happen. Sore POV. Sorry, guys. <laughs> yeah, so does Kai. Also, the things at night. What are they called again? The ones that scratch with the window. Like the Borba. What? Mm -mm. I, I the Borba, it's a two headed wolf that will eat both of your legs if you're not good. What? Is that some kind of fairy tale yes, or something? It's really common. It's he hasn't heard the scratching in two days, but we say. You hear mm. scratching at your door, then at your windows, and then when you go to check it out, you lose both of your legs. Is that what happened to you? Is it consequences for going outside? But this will happen to me. Yeah, I walked in. You learned the hard way. Yes, it is exactly oh. what happened to me. I'm a Borba survivor. I'm so sorry. I didn't know something like that existed. Is it a rift beast or something? Well, they're no, no. they're here. No, it's not it's a rift beast. It's completely natural. A creature. It's what? Two-headed wolf, it's and it's natural. natural? I'm, I'm fairly certain it's, it's magic. It's not a it's, it's a no, magical. It is natural. I've seen it myself when it ate my legs. Well, th just because it exists doesn't mean that it's. That's what I'm not. going with at this point. <laughs> Wait a minute. Are you two oh, just making okay. things up? No. No, she is. I'm telling the truth. I'm not making things up. One of you is. I don't. I don't make things up, Val. I'm a trendsetter. There's a difference. And a what? A trendsetter. Just, how would it go? <laughs> I, I know. Yeah, it's not right. my fault Couldn't that they really didn't show any spells because I didn't know any. But it's like us observing their their strategies. Fair enough. They're, they're uh, fine with it. It's gonna be their fault. Hmm. Which for Dot, I'll put it back to you. Okay. Oh, he has a shield. Yes, he does have a shield. Does he come? That might be a problem. What do you mean? <laughs> Don't worry about it. We are not I'm a little it. worried. Don't, don't worry about that. <laughs> As a word of advice, Luca, I would start researching into the other teams. Sooner or later, another team versus team uh, activity will occur, right? And there are stakes on the line. You've seen Aqua's pull. You've probably heard about what Lumen has gotten and what Ignis has gotten. Nope. Perhaps it's time for you to take your stand. Oh, so we get like rewards for doing Aqua's things? Pull. I heard about Aqua's yeah, pool. Yes. For winning team versus team competition. Yes, they have a pool in their backyard. It's like a hot tub. <laughs> Hold on, Umber team huddle over here. Right. You know those dungeon plans you guys have? We have to win. I don't know. Yeah. Yeah. We have a whole workout chamber. And sauna. Mm. I, that actually is a good idea. And the, the, your idea, the hot string idea? Hmm. We could lift up that grate. Yeah. Perfect. Okay, so we're all agreed, right? Honestly, you we're can all gonna probably work hard to try it. Once, right? If you want to make it a sauna and workout place, start off with the workout by lifting the heavy storage. I mean, there's plenty of room. Move that out of the way. Get some stuff done there. There is. Mm. But even. even Oh, the whole time there's nothing down there. We can use the storage or something until something gets there. Okay. So. That's okay, good plan. What we should do is start looking around at the teams like she suggested. What do you guys think? Mm, uh, Wait, what? Uh, Kendra? Yeah, of, of course. Hmm. You have that notebook. That's the perfect place to write all, all of it our uh, all our weaknesses and strengths down. <laughs> Wait, do you have anything right now in them about other teams? Um, it's a mess right now. Um, so I have to uh, organize it a bit. Um, the teams. We could probably just think about it here and now. 
Hmm. That is true. What do you mean? We just have to say I don't know much about the new needs. students, but... Eh, that's where we come in. Probably. Well... Terra has, um, someone like me. They have a spear and a shield. They also have some people with a sword. Am I whispering? <laughs> no, you're good. I, 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 am, am I good? Okay. <laughs> um, Terra has basically me. A uh, spear and a shield. They have a sword. I don't know about the... The new one? I don't, I don't think... Severe doesn't have anything. Right? Safira. Not too sure on Safira myself. What, do, what does Safira do actually? I haven't seen them do anything. I don't remember which one that is. Is that the small one? The other, the other Viki. One of them. The white hair. Yeah, with white, uh, hair. Yeah, white hair. Um, her arm is different. I think she's on... Uh, I think she has magic. That she uses. Primarily. I'm not sure because I've about never it. really tested it, but would a cult go through other magics? Like, how do you mean? Oh. If magic's an issue, I can focus on training in that sort of field. Yeah, I think if we can start developing spells for everybody, um, for Caleb and, and uh, Angel, who don't have one yet, that'd be great. Maybe we could get something, um, mm. maybe we could all work on some kind of, like, team synergy or something. What do you think would be good with, um... Team. Maybe so. Spell. Yeah. Like a, like a secret mm. signature combo or something. Hmm. Did we have a signature combo? Mm, no. Not that. Well, I mean, we can start thinking about it now. We have the base idea of the wall through any electricity. Hmm. Do you have earth magic? I mean, Electrocute everybody. Much I've spent time with them. Easier said than done. Um, my magic hasn't advanced in a while, and... Actually, if you think about it, the majority <laughs> of the weapons are metal, right? Hmm, you're right. Yeah. Other than big shield. It'd make them drop their weapons and if, if it's we... electricity. We could disarm them. Except unless there's people with wooden shields. Like Kingsley! Yeah. Which I suppose is where you could come in. Hmm. Maybe if this earth magic actually comes from the ground, maybe you could tumble someone like Kingsley off their feet. Oh. Ah, it's doable. I'm not entirely sure what Earth ranges from. Neither do I, but it seems good. It's worth a try. That'd be something good to look into. Some kind of magic that lets you um, take care of heavy threat targets, like immobilize them or something like that. Hmm. I suppose to myself. Maybe if that doesn't work on the shields, I can try mine. Oh, there is, there is. Maybe blast a few bolts at them or something. That'd be good. I, I, I don't really know much about hmm. occult magic, but since you said it focuses on destruction, then yeah, that makes the most sense. Hmm. Wait, are they even going to let us use our magic uh, in these team competitions? If not, um, then we can plan something else. I think they let us use it last time. Yeah, um... Hmm. When we had that big team battle. Light, so. hmm. mm. Perfect. Okay. So overall, it doesn't really matter what everyone else has. We need to just focus on what we have and make it work. Okay, so right. let's all get in agreement here. Let's all work on our our tactics, team tactics, our our abilities with melee fighting, and then you two need to focus on growing your magic. Probably more important than mm -hmm. the, the fighting part. This is a good idea. Yeah. Perfect. Right. And we can help each other out. So me and you can focus heavily on the melee, and then you guys can focus on the magic together. And then that's like inner team bonding. Hmm. 
take notes from each other, see what we can find out. And we'll all like secretly... Like chain. Yeah. And we'll all secretly look in on the other teams. And since you're really good with that notebook, <laughs> you can you can be our 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 idea man for what good tactics there would be to take care of a team. Yes, I can do that. I'll I'll write up some things. Um, if we come down here, I suppose whenever we're free, just sort of see if anyone's oh. saying anything out here. Hmm. Keep it out. Caleb, we can practice. We can do what we did before. Remember, like we boost each other up and then we get onto the balcony. And then we can look through the window. Mm. Yeah. <laughs> Team bonding. Team bonding. Team bonding. Something that's been on my mind because I've seen Solus over there. He relies on his fire magic to do some damage, and if you have water, that completely counteracts that. Hmm. That's true. Well, it can also turn it into steam. A big problem. You just have to beat out the fire, I suppose. So then, so then that's a good point. To help turn in your magic. We need to I find out who counters us and who we counter, and then come up with plans for the people that we can't counter. Well, I imagine if my magic's just the dark, I imagine anyone who has the the light variant would be my counter. Hmm. Whoever that may be. Isn't divine used for healing and stuff? I suppose so. So I don't maybe know you're too their much counter. About divine itself. I just know it's the opposite. Maybe hmm. so. I'll have to learn more about it. For now, though, I've only got 20 more minutes before I have to go to sleep. Do you guys want to go back to the dorm and, um, oh, right. I guess, figure out what we need to figure out? We should probably discuss. We should probably vote before yeah. you go to bed. Yeah. Right. Yeah. Okay. Cool. Right. Come should we take the teleporter, or are we so scared of you think? We could go one at a time if you're scared. Have any students fused in the past? Know, Good question. Well, I haven't seen anybody fused. Of. It's probably fine then. Oh. But... I used to teleport the first time mm. and I fused when I came out. But I don't think anybody slipped on that. Oh yeah, I almost hurled chunks the first time. And the second time. And the third time. And the last time I used it. I got used to it about after the fourth time, I think. So, like, day three, <laughs> day four. Uh, that's what they keep saying. Okay, here <laughs> we go. Uh, which one of these is it? This one, right? There it is. Okay, I got a gun, apparently it's it's just not, it's still okay. Is your hand okay? Just slammed it. It's fine. <laughs> it's fine. Did you slam it on the crystal? I might have slammed it on the crystal. <laughs> Be careful. It's fine. Might get some crystal. Uh right. Let's get to this. But, like you said, Caleb, whatever doesn't kill me only makes me less killable. Okay, but what does <laughs> kill you makes you dead, so be mindful of that. That's a good point. Well, if I'm dead, I don't think that's just the way to say it. Stronger. But if you're dead, then yeah, we gotta pick I... up the slack. Oh. Yeah, I need your strength. Oh, I wouldn't so I won't die. Perfect plan. That's a bush. Yeah. Dead bush. Lupus Arkham wants to join me. Ew, cringe. <laughs> they are wholesome. Very nice. strategy, even. If it, if it takes place within the school grounds, maybe we could hide in the bushes and sneak attack. Hmm. And we have we have spheres too. We can like you know, from the. Hmm. Hey, Team Ignis, what are your biggest weaknesses? Uh, fire. Fuck you. Okay. For thank no you. Okay. Fire and fuck you. That's. I thought we were friends. <laughs> Screaming? 
Though? Dude, I would love to have lupus in here, man. Wait, why would it, why would Ignis's weakness be fire? I don't know. That doesn't make sense. Maybe he just said the first thing that popped <laughs> to his man mind. Maybe. If it's the psychic eye, it wasn't very smart. <laughs> okay. What's wrong? What's up? Um, nothing. We should uh, get to the voting. Okay. So, I know you two are, are new, but I think mm. it's fair that we can vote for anybody here. Like, I know we've been here longer, but I think you two are need a chance to be a good leader. Well, that's what I believe it. Taku and Skyhead they said the same thing. But we should go over, you know, what we don't have and what we don't, I feel. But, you know, you, you guys have experience. You've been here longer than us. Obviously, we're new. That kind of thing. Yeah, I guess we could talk about what, what the plus we can and... do in that role. Yeah. I think I get what you're saying. Yeah. Hmm. To see what points there are to give and... I guess whoever has the highest points, per se, would be best suited. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. That makes sense. Well, I don't know, just something like? I thought of. Oh, it with. I can't say for myself. I wouldn't say it's fair to judge myself. I mean, it could be anything. Maybe yeah, like, you make a really good omelet. Yeah, what are your talents? <laughs> talents? I've never really thought much outside of doing the magic stuff. <clears throat> I got nothing. <laughs> hmm. Well, I'm sure you've got something. But maybe we'll give you some time to think about it or something. Um, maybe that's something just to find out along the way. Mhm. Mm Absolutely. But yourself, talents? Um. Well, I've got um, tactical knowledge from being trained under a, uh, a sword fighter in Palvindor, and uh, I've got some magical knowledge as you've seen but it's not very strong um <laughs> as far as what I would bring to a leadership position uh, I guess I don't mind taking the brunt of talking to teachers and stuff like that okay and well, for none of that I suppose I've had a good talk with some of the teachers I could also step up for one of that um, I wouldn't call it a talent. I have, I've had a thing. I wouldn't really call it a talent. More sort of what I'm good at. Nothing special. Natural, uh, you know, wilderness survival. I sort of have an idea of what's safe to eat, what's safe isn't, what isn't safe. Uh, sorry, that kind of thing. Just something to throw out there, I suppose. It's useful. Hmm. What about you guys? Are either of you trying to... Do either of you want to be um, leader of the team? It's been a little bit of a sore subject. Yeah. But... Hmm. I'd, I'd like to think that... I don't... Oh, go ahead. Okay. I'd, I'd like to think I'm ready to hold up the mantle that uh, we were left. Mainly because I want to protect all of you. I don't know you two very well, but I want to get I want to get to know you two very well. I know you two will make 
Good news. Great additions. Hmm. I guess that's all I can do, really. Uh, Canem, yourself? Um, I'm... I... I don't think I'm ready to... to lead. Uh, that's understandable, I suppose. Yeah. I'll... I'll be a team member, if that's okay. Sure. I think it's a little odd to have us decide between ourselves. I don't know if that's just me. Yeah. Feels like a, it's a little bit of a strange pressure, huh? Hmm. But I do have my, uh, my answer. If we are, we're just going to throw them out. Caleb, why don't we start with you since you're not... Uh, I guess in the running. Who are you going to vote for for team leader? Um, I would probably say... Uh, I, I think... Uh, you, uh, Luca. Um, oh, you... Yeah, he reminded me more of... Um, Kai and... Uh, you're also more, um, I guess, charismatic, or talk, but if, um, I think you'll be a good, um, fit. Thanks, Caleb. Mm. What about you, Yiko? I think I'd have to vote for you. Okay, two for me. What about uh what about you, Angio? That's it. Huh? Yourself. Oh. You seem to have the most confidence out of all of us. You seem to be quite talkative. You get to know a lot of the people a lot easier than I think some of us could. You know. Okay. Um, well, I guess my vote Um Well, I was gonna vote for Eco. Um, from what I understand, there's second in commands, right? Uh, yeah. That's, that's right. And that would be yourself. If you want. Sure. Great. That'd be fine with that. All right. All right. Suppose we should let the professor know. Is that what we said? I guess so. Um, yeah. Well, thank you all for your confidence. I'll, I'll, I won't let you down. You do a great job. Yeah, I, I know you all. Hmm. Happy to have you as a leader. Thanks. Yeah, speak to. Mm. Um. Yeah. I guess. Who are we supposed to just talk to any professor? Would it be? The Korea or Skyhand? I would go around. Um... Okay. I think if you find any professor and ask to talk to the chancellor, they probably. Message. Got it. I'll do that. And then I have to retire for the night. So I'll see you guys tomorrow, okay? Mm. All right. Have well, a well. good night's sleep. Take care, yes. guys. Good night. Whoa. I mean, team team picking is always awkward, no matter what, right? Especially when you have to like do an open vote. <laughs> <clears throat> Let's go. Team Captain Luca. <laughs> it's so sad. Freaking Eco sounded so sad. Okay, where is the professor? Hmm, I don't see a single one. A 
Second with the last captain? Oh. Yeah, I mean, Luke is just very, he's very down to business, you know? So, of course, he wants to go like, hey, let's work on formations, because that's what I'm good at. Because <laughs> I suck ass at magic. Hey. Sword, but a bayonet on the end. Oh. Have either oh. of you seen um, a professor or uh, the chancellor? Uh, you may find a professor over at the arena. I believe the last we saw was Mordred sparring with. Uh, I think Abby. I saw Cadwell yes. there as well. Mm. Great, perfect. Oh, that is true, he was around the side, wasn't he? I'll check it out. Yeah. Thanks, guys. See ya. I've been in a leadership role every RP. Well, kind of, right? Mirren became yeoman. Um, Bertram is a fixer, but he's not like a leader. What other RPs in my leadership role or leadership role in? No one admitted to it. Professor. <sighs> but one of them did it. Sorry to interrupt. Is the chancellor I'm nearby? So sorry. I don't know. Last I saw him, he was in the main campus. Oh, okay. Thank you. <sighs> oh, yeah. Student body president, team captain. Uh, yeah, I'm a corporal in, in Mayday. Hey, yeah. Do you happen to know where Mertish is? I... I haven't seen him in a long time, but have you seen the Chancellor? No, but the Chancellor usually, if it's really important, you can just go and knock on his door and... I tried that, but it wasn't there. Mm -hmm. I'll, uh, I'll you try again. Ask oh, sure. The... Yeah, that'd be great. Can you make this captain to everyone? If anyone has seen the Chancellor Malad, please let me know. Also, Murtish Mishimo, if anyone died the <laughs> Look up for Yeoman. Thank you. I over. Oh yeah, Norman was the Undercity, like, leader, wasn't he? Leader of the project. Seems like two captains are over there. So, I hmm. think you've seen them. Only okay. One. Um, I'll try again. Has anyone seen that? Thank you. Oh, so they'll keep, they'll keep an eye out, but we'll most likely find him before him. He's okay. usually around the, the main building area anyways, but... Hmm. Great. I'll go search for uh... Thank you. I'm gonna go look in the, the main campus again. Actually, wait. If you do What's see up? them, uh, just let them know they decided, uh, team member has decided to make uh, me, uh, Luca Nasir, captain. Hey, congrats. Thank you. I look forward nice to, to see um, a fellow. Nice to see a new fellow captain. Hmm. Yeah. So if you see him, let him know. Otherwise, I'm gonna go knock on his door a bunch. All right. Thank you. Have fun, captain. Mm. <laughs> yep, I gotta go to Leo and be like, hey bud, I have to get the, the cape now. And he's gonna go, oh my god, I thought I was done with Luca. 
Too distracted by playing running with rifles and I immediately come on and suddenly hear Luke, it's team captain. Very confused. Well, we are chancellors in the spawn. Well, that's unfortunate. Ho, ho, ho. Ho, ho, ho. What's, what's down here? Whoa. Neat. Let me just actually get in the Discord and see if he's available. Ah, I don't see him. My brain's not working. What was what? The body. <laughs> Guess what, guys? <laughs> We're implementing a team social credit system. <laughs> Every time you increase in a, a training milestone, you get 10 social credit points. Hey, Angeal. Oh, did you let him know? I actually haven't seen him, and I might have to go soon. Uh... So if you guys see him, just let me know. Uh, you can you can go. Yeah, yeah. Uh, I think you have to go somewhere as well. Um, we were just gonna be on it. So if you need to go somewhere, you can go. Sure. Is you go okay? He <laughs> seemed. I don't know. Uh, I'm sure he'll be fine. It's. Yeah, it's just the new members and the old members. Mm. It's. Hmm. He'll be fine. Okay. He's tough. Right. Well, right. if you need to be off, then go ahead. I'm not sure if I have to be off just yet, but uh, but I might have to disappear at any moment. Mm -hmm. That's fair. Right. So there's no one in this building, is there? I don't think so. Right. Okay. Uh, I imagine training grounds would be where everyone is. Mm. I think so. Right. <laughs> Umber got some baggage. That's okay. It's all makes it more lot that much more juicy. Oh, this must be the library. A lot smaller than I would have thought, but I guess there's a lot of books here, so. Luke will do fine, he's not Mirandel and has absolutely no clue how to do things like talk to people or lead or be competent. What do you mean? Luke is competent. In his own special way. Ah, Luca. Correct? Yes. Are you looking for someone? You seem to be... Mm -hmm. I'm looking for the uh, Chancellor. I uh, just received word that I would be the team leader for... Team Umbra. Ah, I think that's how it's gonna be. Oh, uh, if I recall correctly, there's a uh, knock function on the. Uh, he hasn't been answering. Door. Ah, I see. Um, did you get your earring then? Your Ezra earring that all team leaders get again? Uh, I haven't. I, well, I still have to talk to the Chancellor, but um. Uh, would you be able to let him know on my behalf? Because I have to, unfortunately, um, go attend some private training sessions. Uh, unfortunately... Oh. The professor is fluxing.
Hmm. Well, shoot. I don't see anyone. Good evening, Luca. Good evening. Hey, could you do me a favor? I'm telling all the team captains that I find in the teachers um, to let the chancellor know. And I found uh, the chancellor for you. Oh, you did? Uh, it's behind me, but I suppose not anymore. Oh. What is the issue? Perhaps oh, I, I um... I just needed to let him know about the uh, selections for team captain for Umbra. Oh, oh. right. I suppose that is an issue he'd indulge with. Out of curiosity, do you mind telling me who? Sure. Um, they picked me. Oh. I thought that would happen. I kind of thought Yiko would get it. Uh, he's kinda. been here longer. But, uh... Mm. Well, one more mishap from him and I kill him. So, I don't think they want a captain that's short-term. Uh, I know he's made missteps in the past, but he he seems like a genuinely good person. And he's pretty good at fighting. Callum. Hey, Callum. Well, you're captain. He's your responsibility now. Right. Oh, do you have a second in command picked out? Yeah, it's Eco. Oh. oh. Okay. okay. Professor, I'd like to humbly ask that you have a little faith in him. I'm going to try my best to um, show him the right path. So I think there's a lot of potential under there. That's the chance I know. But I'll hold you to that. The next thing he does to piss me off, I'm coming straight to you. Yes, ma'am. Luca, you're looking for me? Yes, I just came to inform you of the team captain selection for team member. Ah, excellent. And uh, who would that be? Uh, myself. Congratulations, Captain. Thank you, Chancellor. Perhaps we sort him out with the communication airing and the captain said. Yes, uh, we will do that. Can we help you with something? Professor Murder, I here. finally found you. I've been trying to find you for so long. Huh. When did you get here? Yeah. All right, well then, then with that, yeah. look, if you could yeah. follow me. Yes, sir. All right, so I'll tell you a little bit about your responsibilities as captain. Every morning during announcements, you will be coming to my office. And you will be arriving within 60 seconds of the bell or you'll be facing punishment. You and your entire team will be facing punishment. Please, inside. Yes, sir. No. Every day during these announcements, I will tell you what would be going on for the day. And it is your responsibility to relay this information to your team. Now, beyond this, you are responsible for your team's well being. How they act. If they are out of line for any reasons, shit rolls up here. And it is you who will be dealing with the consequences of their actions. And it will be you who will have to educate them. 
This is a lot of responsibility. Beyond that, we are also looking to have team captains be a little more proactive when it comes to the goings on of the institution as a whole. So when there is an issue that comes up, the team captains will have a vote. They will have a say in how the school reacts to any problems or issue that comes up. And you will obviously act as a representative and the voice of Team Umbra when that does happen. So, you understand this is not an insignificant weight that has been put on your shoulders. I understand, sir. Perfect. This here is an Aether Tech earring. It will allow you to communicate with any teacher or other team captain on the island. We ask that you use it sparingly, but once it's connected, push on the little diamond there. And this one here is for the uh, team captains. And this one here is for the uh, uh, professors. Hmm. We ask that you keep any messages on a general brief and concise. Yes, sir. All right. And if any questions for your station. Does this mean I have to get my ears pierced? Yeah, no, it's more of a little clamp. Oh, good. But if you're really dedicated, feel free. <laughs> mm. Uh... Uh... Well, it's scared of a little bit of pain. <laughs> I've never had my ears pierced before. I'm, I don't uh, really well. like... Small pointy it's objects. It's a nice sort of pain. Nice? Pain? Um... Do you have any more questions? Right, um... I don't think so, sir. Um, I heard that we have, have second in the commands, correct? Yes. Okay, uh, what uh, are their roles? the days uh, that you are on the... Mm. On any days you are unavailable to do your duties, whether through sickness or any other issues that come up, it is your second in command that will be your direct second. You, they will be your representative. They will take all of your duties for the time that they are needed. Understood. Okay, um, I think that's everything I had. Oh, uh, training wow. regiments. Right, do I get to decide that, or or mm. do we go by teacher criterion? Absolutely. If you wish to do any uh, team exercises during times where we uh, do not have an event planned, then absolutely. Very good, sir. Mm. I'd like to um, you, you... put a writ in for uh, uh, permission to use the training grounds every morning. Absolutely. Thank you, sir. Of course. And if that is everything, then you are dismissed. Thank you. Can I come to you if I think of any questions in the future? Absolutely. Always. Great. And good luck. Thank you. <laughs> and, um... Don't fuck up. Do I have to wear a sash? Yeah. Yes. Yeah, so we'll give you we'll give you the little caplet. Okay. Uh, thank you again. I won't let you guys down. Uh, I won't course. let the faculty and Hopefully my team not. members down. Well, please don't. You know how I feel about you, guys. Keep close eye on him. Understood, ma'am. I'll make sure he's a lean, mean, fighting uh, ocean machine. Perfect. Very good. Okay. Um, I'll All take right. my leave now. We will leave you to the rest of your evening. Thank you. Thank you, professors, uh, chancellor. I'll see you all on the morrow. Um, okay. <sighs> I wasn't expecting to be a team captain today. Mm.
Deep breaths, deep breaths. Don't be nervous, 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 don't be nervous. Don't be nervous, 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 don't be nerv
Thanks for the follow, Lunar Bun. Thank you.
All right, I'm back, guys. What have you guys done? Oh my god. <laughs> Quit wasting points. Quit wasting all of your good points. What are you gonna run by me? Wasting points? No, they're they're best wasted in smaller amounts. <laughs> I really gotta put in some more uh, redeemables. <laughs> What's up? Are you Hello. ready to save Ariland? I'm ready to do something to Ariland. <gasps> oh. It's fine. It's, it's all the, for the greater it's, it's good. It's the daddy half. It's the part that's not in the RP. We don't need to worry about it. <laughs> Ledford never heard of it. <laughs> oh no. Oh no. Hello, Lottie. Oh, yeah. Yeah, the stick. Hey. You fuck. Oh. oh I burnt it. You fucking. <laughs> oh, wait, I'm not, I don't have full body armor. That was his yeah, good stick. Play. That was my that was good, good stick. stick. That was a great stick. I can't believe you. No, I needed, I needed wood for my bakery, so I was like, no, I'll just it. use this extra firewood. I'm gonna fuck you so up. Paper so, firewood. So, so you know Lottie, I'm going to come fuck you up. That happens on some maps. I had that yesterday on this map. Oh no. I fixed it though. And the rest of my time. That's good. I, I, I know how to cause it now. <laughs> I wish I wish it wasn't that way on the Mayday map. God, I just. It's like, it's every day I'm just like, who are you talking to, to me for what? All you have to do to fix it is put the VR chat spatial audio component on all your audio sources. That's the oh, fix it. what the. And my OVR toolkit froze. Yay! Well, chat, you're dead now. Did you know? You're just fucking dead. Sorry. You don't exist. You're gone. Poof! Just like that. Oops. Oops, I fucked up. I'll tell you why now, because I joined a new map and it decided, well, since he's in a new map, I might as well shit my pants. So it did. It shit its pants. What can you do? Also, let me change the stream title while I'm at it. I am going to, um, quickly cut the stream so I can have a clean VOD. So just stand by with me for one little itsy bitsy second. All right, let's see here. Let's see, we are at episode 64. Boom. Okay, all right, now I'm gonna end the stream and start it again real quick. Be right back! <laughs> 